interesting. What is this thing? Okay. I want each of you to cook a donut for me. It'll be done. This will be the darkest donut. What won't you do for your beloved granddaughter? I think that cooking donuts in a special device is very convenient and fast. You just need to pour the dough. Oh yeah, I can do that. Only my donuts will be color because it's so much more fun. Cool. Granddaughter, you're such a dreamer. <sighs> yeah, there's too much snot. See what a real donut should be like. They're black, but they're probably delicious. <laughs> the black color is the best combined with red. So I'll pour red glaze on my donuts. And I'll add a little white on top. Right now. Let's do this. So they will become even more beautiful. Hand, help me. Bring me a deep plate right now. I'll pour strawberry syrup in it. Stop! Mm. What? Perfect. Then I'll put in sandwiches. What for? Now you'll see for yourself. Hey. Granny, do you want a trick? Look. This is blood. Oh, Who is carrying a lady like that? Come on, it's just syrup. I'm trying for your granddaughter's sake. I want her to taste not only delicious, but also beautiful donuts. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. What? If they had brought that to me, I would have fainted for sure. Now I'll show you how normal donuts should look like. Firstly, there's absolutely no need to make them black. And for beauty, a little powdered sugar will be enough. Just look at how beautiful it is. Awesome! <laughs> oh. Beauty is my donuts. One look at them is enough to cheer yourself up. But to make them even more fun, why not add a little bright sprinkle? However, first I need to open this damn jar. Now come on! Oh. Yeah, Rebecca, you did open the jar. Now look how much more cheerful you are. The main thing is that it got on the donuts. Margot, it's time to pick a winner. Oh, Wednesday made donuts in her own style. They look pretty creepy, but in fact, they are very tasty. And Sergius with syrup is a great idea. Awesome. Grandma, now I'm going to try your donuts. I won't lie, they're so so. Too simple. Oh, but Rebecca's donuts look much more interesting. I hope they taste good too. <sighs> mm, these are the most delicious donuts that I've ever tried! You're the winner! Oh, I love you too, Margot! Hmm. Oh, Wednesday, stop scaring an old lady! In this round, you have to make a cocktail for me. Delicious and beautiful. Okay. It will be done. <laughs> no problem. Good. Oh. A win-win option is to make a cocktail from what Margot loves most. For example, you can start with toxic waste candies. But I don't need the lollipops themselves. I need to make these candies turn into a liquid mass. In general, I need to melt them. Perfect. Now it's time to add candy Skittles. Wow! Let's do this. <laughs> there can be no doubt about it. Everyone loves these sweets. But first, they need to be divided by color so that after they are beautifully distributed among our colored and delicious cups. And now it's time for the Sprite. Let's pour it in. It'll be the basis of the cocktail, only now it is almost impossible to open it. I'll use a hairpin for this. Oh, how so? Wet and sweet. Poor Rebecca. I'm all right. I just took a Sprite shower, but that's not all. What kind of cocktail without whipped cream? And a little candy won't hurt. Ta-da! My masterpiece is ready. Oh, you're so great. But your cocktails are not healthy at all. And Margot needs vitamins, so the cocktail should be as useful as possible. Vitamins are mostly in vegetables, so why not just make a vegetable cocktail? Perfect. It's 
smells great. I'm sure Margot will be absolutely delighted. I doubt that. I'll start making my cocktail with strawberry syrup. I'll pour it into a glass so that it immediately becomes much more beautiful. Then the spray will go into action, which I will touch up a little with the help of green syrup. Hand, I need your help again. Still some whipped cream for me. <laughs> Someday I'll crush this thing. It's so creepy. Hey. And it stole my cream. Thank you. You did everything right. And they're just joking. Finally, I'll add cream to the cocktail and, of course, why not decorate it with a marmalade eye? In my opinion, it turned out cool. Margot, decide which cocktail is the winner. Wednesdays always has the most original one. Okay. Let's see. Mm. You've got a very delicious cocktail. Marmalade is just the cherry on the cake, more precisely, an eye. Oh. Grandma, have you made a mixture of all the vegetables again? You know I can't stand this stuff. Ugh, disgusting! And my sister came out with something cool again! Let's try how it tastes! Amazing! Rebecca, you have one again! Hooray! Don't worry, someday you'll be lucky! Surprise me with delicious pasta this time! Okay! I have a couple of thoughts! Oh, oh, pasta? Oh, oh, okay, easily. There's nothing easier than cooking spaghetti for my granddaughter. Do you know how I'll know that the water in the pot is hot? A hand will help me. Never repeat it at home because the thing does not feel the heat at all. Although, it's still unpleasant for it. Creamy oh. spaghetti is boring. Why don't I cook them myself? I have flour. <laughs> oh! Oh, now everyone has flour! Don't yell, Grandma! Didn't mean to! We need to knead the dough. And to do this, you need to add raw eggs. Um, oh. Then roll it all thoroughly. So, the foundation is ready. It's time to color the dough so that the spaghetti turns out bright. Next, you need to roll out the dough in a special machine and then cut it into spaghetti knits. So my color pasta will be ready soon. Nice. Even store raw spaghetti can be cooked with what? love. However, because of this steam, I can't see anything at all. Rebecca, did I overdo with the ketchup? No, Grandma, you didn't even open it. Oh, what am I? Oh, what a horror! Oh, Wednesday. Oh Look, you usually oh, no. like this kind of spectacle. <sighs> Oh, Rebecca, thanks for the napkin. I'll finally be able to continue cooking pasta. Have very little left to add ketchup to the spaghetti. Delicious, but so boring. Do you know how to make spaghetti more interesting? We need to paint them black. Grandma gave me an interesting idea. Why not add horror to my portion with ketchup and an eye? I do like this idea. Oh it's God. very scary. <laughs> Another thing is my color pasta. Hope Margot will appreciate it. Nice. <laughs> Wednesday, will you stop scaring me already? The food is, again, very interesting, but this is not pasta. Grandma, but you make classic spaghetti with ketchup. It's pretty delicious. You're my girl. <sighs> I wonder what Rebecca has come up with. I hope these spaghetti are not only beautiful, but also delicious. Awesome! I try specially for you. Rebecca, you've won again! Hooray! I'm lucky! Hmm. Wednesday, I almost forgot. I brought a hairpin especially for you. I think it'll suit very well. I don't wear such things. <laughs> oh. And this time, prepare Caesar salad for me. Easy. I can cook salads. I'll try. For Caesar, the main thing is not to spare cabbage. Some chicken. And of course, rat crackers, which are too contracted to me because they're too tough. And some grated cheese on top. I know Margot adores it. I'll make a spring gift for Margot. It won't be Caesar, but 
I think she'll like my edible flowers on long stems. <gasps> Wednesday, look! What a cool idea! Nothing cool. Here's my idea, and it's really cool. I'll make a salad right in the pepper. I'll paint all the ingredients there. Be sure to make a tongue out of cucumber, and I'll make eyes out of olives. Look what a cute frog I got. <laughs> Let's see what you have repaired this time. Rebecca, you've come up with something really cool! But it tastes like the most ordinary vegetables. Here, Granny knows how to cook delicious Caesar. And today's no exception. It's very tasty. Wednesday, are those olives? I can't stand them. Grandma, congratulations on your victory. Oh, finally. I've been waiting for so long. Give me glasses here. I want a donut. Will you make one? Let's see. Yeah, I will. I'm ready. Oh, I'd love to make this donut for you. First, I'll pour the dough into this donut maker. Okay, I'll fill in all the spots. That's it. Perfect. Now I'll close it. And wait a little. And I'll make the perfect rainbow donuts. Because simple donuts are so boring. Mine will be the most rosy, the most fun, and of course the most delicious. I'll definitely win this challenge. Oh, what a good fellow you are. That's awesome. You will succeed. But what about you? Of course, black donuts are the tastiest, but something is missing. Of course, a delicious sauce. Hand, help me with this. Come on. Okay. Oh, what a nightmare! I'm afraid of it! Give me the bowl here. Okay. Now I have a place to pour strawberry sauce in. And now I'll use this. It'll be more convenient to decorate donuts this way. That's what I need. We need to cheer them up. Oh, what is it? What is this? It's just strawberry sauce. Oh, you scared me. That was ridiculous. Now I'll decorate my donuts with sauce and most delicious icing. The decoration is just brilliant. They're beautiful and delicious. Some scary ones. And my beautiful donuts are ready. I'll spread them out and sprinkle with powdered sugar. This is so classic. Very tasty recipe. Yes, this is what you need. Look. Very good. Cool. Looks good. And look at my donuts. My most rosy ones. Very nice donuts. Just a sight. I want to sprinkle them with sprinkles. It doesn't open. What a tight lid. Open. Oh, oh no. Oops. <laughs> okay. I'll sprinkle them like this. Yeah, this combination is the most delicious. Okay, dear, eat it. How delicious! This is a very interesting donut. And it's funny. I'll try it. Hmm, it's quite tasty. So beautiful. I like it. What you need. And these? Hmm, so simple. I think I'll try the next one. Wow! These are rainbow donuts! They smell so good! Mmm! How delicious! All the donuts turn out to be good, but which ones to choose? Of course, these ones! I'm very happy. How do you open this? I want pasta! Prepare it for me! It's like boiling water. So, I will quickly prepare the most delicious pasta. That's almost it. Hmm. Hmm. What do I have here? Probably hot. Hmm. Hand over here. Now you're going to help me find out if the water has boiled. No! Hmm. Thanks. I see it has boiled. Hand, 
Are you burnt? No. It was very hot. So the water is ready. <laughs> what are you going to do? I think I'll make the pasta myself. Oh, I'm covered in flour. <laughs> but it's okay. It's even a bit of fun. That's better. I'll put the flour on a board. And now I'll make real handmade pasta. Be sure to add eggs, salt. Now I'm going to knead this dough. It's not easy, of course, but it'll be very tasty. I will have the most unusual pasta. I'll make individual pieces and, of course, I'm going to add something extra. I will add paints. That's it. I'll have pasta in all colors of the rainbow. The most beautiful lilac pasta. Now I will form a piece. I'll have several of these. And now I will cut them into small pieces and, of course, use a grater. This will give them shape. Well, the pasta goes into the pan. You're so good. What a smart girl. So my pasta is quite ready. Then you probably need to add some ketchup. Oh, oh, uh, I, I can't see anything. My glasses. Oh, is it ketchup after all? Or not ketchup? We need to squeeze out more. Crema, let me help you. We need to open it. Hold it. Oh, oh I think I'm all smeared in ketchup. Oh, uh, yeah, it's definitely ketchup. Oops. We need to be more careful. Don't laugh. I made my pasta. Oh, oops. Actually, much better this way. <laughs> it's already done. Now into the plate. Something is clearly missing. And to me. Now we'll make this pasta prettier. Cuttlefish ink is what I need. Like has never heard before. I will make my pasta. Awesome. Oh, what a black, gloomy, beautiful pasta. Now that's what it needs. The only thing it lacks is red. Adding some ketchup. I'll pour it on top. <laughs> so beautiful, bud. It will be even better with the eyes. <gasps> what is it? Uh, oh, she's like always. I got such a rainbow pasta. I just want to eat it. Hooray! Try it, Jill. <laughs> um, hmm. this is a strange dish. Need to try it, but honestly, I don't want to. It doesn't look delicious. Ugh, it's disgusting! Ugh. And I want this pasta. Mmm, that's delicious. Okay. I would love to eat this pasta. Oh, this is what I need. It's so beautiful. Mmm, I love it. That's the winner. Hooray, there it is. I've beaten you guys. We need to prepare. I want a drink! Delicious and sweet! Hand, okay. are you ready? Okay. I'm ready! Oh, I almost fell! What is there? Oh, got that! Hey. Should I start? Please. Okay. okay, so I will take very beautiful but sour candies. They will help me to implement my idea. So, I'm going to put them in the malls. There'll be a multicolored miracle. I took them because they're so beautiful. Oh, um, they're over. Well, okay. The midden in place. And I'll put them in the oven. It'll be necessary to warm them up a little. That's it. And now it's time to cool my dish. I'm going to pull it out of the mold. What a beauty turned out. Oh, yeah. Gorgeous goes, but pretty sour. Now I'll take M&Ms. And of course, sort them by color. It'll be even more beautiful this way. Huh? How delicious it is! I'll add M&Ms to the drink and of course fill it with Sprite. 
What a delicious cocktail! It'll be even tastier with cream. It's very cool. With sprinkles, it's going to be delicious. And beautiful. And tiny straws. It's something incredible. I will make my granddaughter a very healthy celery cocktail. I'll take the whole one. I think I can do it. Oh, come on! It's disgusting. She'll probably won't like it. Well, my most healthy cocktail for my granddaughter is ready. Beautiful and so many vitamins. Top it with a spring of celery and a straw. It's very cool. No. Hand a glass. I'll take a proper glass and, of course, smear with strawberry syrup. Hmm, what should I pour here? Perhaps it'll be Sprite. Of course, I'll add the dye. And stir it all with the rice straw. And help. Okay. Oh! Oh, you scared me again! Once they take it away! Hand, hurry up. <laughs> Super thanks, Hand. Cream is just right. It is very similar to brains, but for the best effect, I'll pour red syrup. And put an eye and a spider on top. That's delicious. Perfect. <laughs> Everyone has different tastes. Try mine. How beautiful! I'll try this cocktail. Oh, it's very good. And delicious. Huh? And this one? <laughs> I won't even try this one. No! I'll try this. How delicious! Delicious! An edible glass? Oh, it's sour! But the drink is very tasty. It's the winner! I'll have another one. Hooray! I won again! I'm so glad! What is it this time? Now I want a salad. Like this, with crackers. Yes, of course. No problem. I got you. I'll take the lettuce leaves and be sure to tear them up. Oh, uh, oh! What are you offering me? Oh, thanks, but don't play like that anymore. I need these green leaves. They're so healthy, delicious. It'll be a wonderful salad. And this is wonderful meat. It also needs to be cut into pieces just right for a salad. Now, I will arrange it nicely. I'm making Caesar salad, so I'm going to need some tomatoes. There are not enough crackers yet. Mm -hmm. Crackers are what you need for such a wonderful salad. A little more cheese for full taste. Very wonderful. I'm ready now. And you? And I'm in the middle of everything. I'll make use of such buddy molds. I'll cut out figures from cucumbers, radish, and pepper. Yeah, it's so beautiful. And I'll put them on sticks. I'm going to have a salad kebab. Just right. How beautiful. I'd rather not ask you. How fun. Now I'll make a bouquet. It turned out to be a wonderful, delicious salad bouquet. And the smell. Super. It's not funny at all. Oh, red pepper. It's just right. I'll cut you now. You need to remove the seeds and put a salad instead. I'll cut the cucumber into slices. I love knives. And I'll make a very beautiful funny face that bites. Maybe. Beautifully put salad monsters on a plate. I have everything ready. Hooray! So much food! Oh, sticks! An interesting salad. To be honest, it's not very tasty. What else would I eat? What kind of faces are these? What's that black thing, huh? Uh, it's a 
an olive! It tastes disgusting. What kind of salad is this? Oh, yeah! That's it! This is the winner! Oh, I've won! Looks like grandma and sister are having a great time. Well, enough distractions. It's time to find out what we'll cook. A burger? Wow! Well, are you all ready for a new challenge? Let's go! So, grandma starts with burger buns. Yes, toasted buns are much better! Now we need minced meat. Grandma takes minced meatballs. Puts them in a frying pan. Presses down with a spatula like this. The patty is ready. Now a slice of delicious cheese and, of course, what kind of burger without tomato? There's an onion and a bun on top. Wow, Grandma coped with the task so quickly. Great job, Grandma. Now it's sister's turn. It looks like the ordinary buns won't do. What? A donut? How delicious! The sister cuts the donut into two halves. Now the chocolates. How sweet it is! But sister has something else. It's sour gel! It's so delicious, but so sour! Now let's add marshmallows. A little marmalade. And berry syrup. Why not? Now we cover our miracle burger. What a beauty! It looks like grandma appreciated her granddaughter's work, but one day is not so easy to surprise. So we start as usual with buns. Of course, the black ones. Frying a patty like this. What is one's to do with a piece of cheese? Wow, how cool this cheese looks now! A piece of cucumber? Okay. Wow, this burger seems to have a mouth with a tongue. But something is missing. It's good that next to Wednesday, there's always a hand that will help with any problem. Marmalade eyes! Wow. Hello! <laughs> Looks like that what Wednesday needs. Hey, careful, Grandma! The hand is completely harmless. Now let's add ice to the burger. Okay. Wow, just look at this monster! He's so scary, but still so appetizing. But which burger will be the most delicious? Now we'll find out. Margot, your turn. Oh, how hungry I am! Hmm, this burger looks unusual. Let's try it! Delicious! I like it! So, what's next for us? Let's take the first bite. Ew! Is that onion? What a mess! The burger is not what you need. So, what do we have here? These are my favorite sweets! Snack on marmalade with a donut? It's to my taste. Well, it's time to choose the winner. And that is… This burger. Yes, this is our winner. Wow, congratulations to Wednesday. Um, is it just me or is she smiling? Wednesday smiling? Wow. Oops, that looks like someone was shy. It seems the sister and the hand have found a common language. Oh, it's time for the hand to go home. And it's time for our heroes to cook a new dish. Hot chocolate! Who doesn't love this delicious drink? I hope everyone is ready. Let's go. Grandma takes up cooking again. She pours milk into a saucepan. Now cacao powder. Do not forget to stir. Oh yes, a bar of chocolate will make the taste even more intense. Mm, how sweet it is! Grandma pours hot chocolate into her signature mug. Great job, Grandma! Now it's sister's turn. Hey, careful! You can eat all the chocolate like that. Yeah, Grandma is right. Sugar needs to be added quite a bit. Like that. Oh, what is she up to? Yeah, just look at this sweet tooth. Grandma does not approve of this amount of sugar. Okay, it's time to add milk. Be careful. Oops. Yeah, the sister clearly needs to be more attentive. So, you can add all the ingredients. Now a little dye. Wow, look at this beauty. This cream is so bright. Now a little sprinkles. <laughs> that's the serving. Sister did her best. But that's not all. 
The final touch is whipped cream and some marshmallows. Look at the sweetness. Yeah, sister did her best. Wow. Perfect. Well, it's your turn, Wednesday. A suitable mug is neat here. The hand, we can't do without your help here. What a horror! Grandma, you better take care of your nerves. Wednesday pours chocolate and some whipped cream. Berry syrup? Uh, great, and some Haribo marmalades. Oh yeah, look at this unique serving. Hot chocolate is ready. Hmm. Why? Oh, it's crazy! This is delicious! I like it! <gasps> oh, and moving on. This is hot chocolate from grandma. Great. Um, what is this? It looks strange, but let's try. Hmm, not bad. And the winner is… Yes! Sister, this round is for you! Well, it looks like our heroes are ready for a new challenge. What a waste them this time. Whoa, it's french fries! There are many ways to cook and serve this dish. Now we'll find out which way our heroes will choose. Of course, the potatoes need to be peeled first. What's going on? Wow, sister has chosen a very unusual way of peeling potatoes. Grandma is unhappy, but how can she be angry at her beloved granddaughter? Now you need to get the potatoes. That's it. The sister cuts potatoes with a special knife. Look at this beauty! It's time to add some color. Wow, that is so bright! Add oil. And we can set our bright potatoes to the frying pan. Great! With hot oil, you should always be extremely careful. Hey, be careful! We beautifully spread our colored potatoes on a plate. Sister got such bright french fries. Grandma prefers a more classic version of the dish. And sometimes the classic version is the best, isn't it? Oh yeah, french fries and ketchup. This taste is familiar to everyone since childhood. What could be better? Oops. Great job, Grandma. Hooray! Okay. Well, what will surprise us this time with Wednesday? The Wednesday potatoes are already cooked. It looks like an usual serving. But wait. What is this? No! Oh no. Looks like Wednesday got the sides mixed up. Grandma, you better cover your eyes. This is not a sight for the faint-hearted. So, where were we? Oh yeah, french fries. Wednesday paints potatoes black. Wow, how beautiful it is. It looks like sister appreciated Wednesday dish too. Look at her reaction. Well, let's see what Margot thinks. Well, what do we have what? here? Whoa, is this potato a little burnt? No, okay. doesn't taste bad. And with ketchup? Just super. Oh, I guess I won't hold back and eat everything to the last piece. Yummy. To the next one. Well, guys, hmm, not bad. Let's see. But it'll taste even better this way. Well, goodbye, potatoes. I'm gonna eat you. Wow! Mm, I think I've had a little too much, but there's still a third course. What a beautiful dish! Yeah, it's all very right, tasty. All right, all right. I can already feel it. Awesome. So good. To the last piece. Mm. Wow! Oops. Oh. <gasps> Don't worry, I'm fine! Well, guys, are you all ready for the next challenge? So, let's see. Pancakes! Oh, how delicious it is! 
I hope our heroes know how to cook this wonderful dish. There are so many ways. Well, let's go. Grandma as always takes up cooking the first. Carefully pour the pancake batter into the pan. Great. See the crust? You can turn it over. And this pancake is just perfect. That's what many years of experience mean. <laughs> Wednesday, what's the matter with you? Oh, it looks like you can't do it without the help of a hand. Black tie? Of course. Who doubted? It? It's Wednesday. Look at this color. Hey, it looks like she got a little carried away. Um, okay. Let's get back to our pancakes. Wow, that's actually beautiful. Yeah, black food always looks so stylish. And what is your favorite color? Leave your options in the comments and maybe in the next video we'll do that. Meanwhile, the sister seems to have something interesting in mind. Wow, this is not a pancake anymore, but a whole piece of art. Yeah! Oh, um, somehow this color does not want to squeeze out in any way. What's the matter with you? Ouch. It was a short ride in the eye. Hope everything is alright with our sister. Yeah, everything is fine. In this case, the most important thing is not to give up despite all the difficulties, right? We're getting it. Wow, it's a unicorn! Just look at this beauty! Yeah, such moments grandma is so proud of her granddaughter. Hmm, and what about grandma? It looks like a good old recipe is waiting for us. Pancakes with butter and maple syrup. From this, salivation immediately begins to flow. I think Wednesday's pancakes are baked too. Yeah, they look unusual. Wednesday has her favorite berry syrup. And… Whoa, are those spiders? Calm down, Grandma, these spiders are made out of chocolate. Well, Margo, it's time to taste the dishes of our participants. Uh. Oh, what is this? Looks terrifying. Hmm, let's try the pancake. Hmm, not bad. What's next for us? Wow, how delicious! And the taste is just super. What kind of beauty is this? A unicorn! How sweet it is! And how delicious! Okay, I think I've decided on the winner. Awesome! Here it is! Congratulations, sister! You deserve the victory! <laughs> what are you waiting for? I'm hungry! We're waiting for your instructions. I want you to make pasta for me in the first round. Pasta? Okay. 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 Granny, wake up! Granddaughter wants noodles! Noodles? Oh, that's easy. I've cooked spaghetti for her more than once, so there is nothing difficult about it, all according to the classic recipe. Oh, yeah. oh sorry. It's flour. It's okay. Sorry again. I just want to make my own spaghetti. After the flour, eggs will be used. I can even juggle them. Ouch! Oops, stop! Ah, oh, and again, forgive me. I always thought I was a pretty good juggler. Well, when the dough is ready, you need to divide it into small balls and paint each in a certain color. After that, with the help of a special machine, I will cut the dough into the noodles themselves. To do this, you just need to carefully scroll the dough into the machine. In my opinion, it turns out very cool and most importantly, original. Everyone will have simple noodles and I will have spaghetti in a form of flour. <laughs> Granny, how are you doing? Everything's fine. My granddaughter has always loved ordinary spaghetti with ketchup. So why don't I offer her them? Wednesday, what are you doing? Thing, I need your help. I don't want my noodles to look like the classic ones. It's so much boring. If you add a little black dye, it will be perfect. I will also add ketchup. It will be in the roll of blood. By the way, in addition, I will put marmalade eyes on the top so it complements the composition. Baby, are you ready to try and choose a winner? I don't even know where to start! Perhaps the first thing I'll try is classic grandma's noodles! I've adored it since childhood! I think nothing will change this time! 
Oh, just as I thought, delicious and simple. Enid's noodles will be next. Turn out, of course, unrealistically beautiful and very cute. This is a real work of art. I don't even want to eat it. Enid also added extra pasta. They are very similar to the vampire's fangs. Don't you think so? Scary. Oh, they're not cooked. Dry, unrealistically to eat them. Oh, Wednesday's noodles are left. Hmm, not bad. Okay, the first thing I want, to try the eye. Oh, is it marmalade? I love this! Wednesday, how did you know that marmalade goes well with noodles? It's just unrealistically cool! I will finish such delicious noodles whole! I won't even leave a drop of sauce on the plate! I think the winner is obvious here, right? <laughs> the best noodles were made by Wednesday! How is it? I tried to! Wednesday, put it away now! Stop scaring an elderly woman! Baby, are you ready to give us a new task? Yes, I want a cocktail. Can you do it? Easily. It will be the best. For you, of course, granddaughter. Okay. I can make cocktails, and now I will make it so that you will never forget it in your life. The basis of the cocktail will be the regular Sprite. It needs to be poured into a glass of such an unusual shape. Now you need to drop a secret ingredient inside, which will give the Sprite the right color. It will turn green. Thing, run over to Enid's right now and get some cream. What kind of devil's hand is that? Get away! Granny, don't offend my assistant. The thing only does what I say. I need cream in order to pour them on the cocktail and put marmalade eyes on top. Just like these. I admit, marmalade eyes are my favorite sweetness. It looks cool and it's also unrealistically delicious. A little red syrup won't hurt either. What am I waiting for? It's time for me to start making a cocktail too! It's definitely worth starting with marmalade candies! To begin with, they need to be divided into groups by color. Ready? Now they need to be laid out in layers in a tall glass. Just look at how beautifully it turns out! With a hair dryer, these marmalades need to be melted so they turn into a homogeneous mass. And the last step is whipped cream! They always give drinks a more presentable look! A small marmalade will not superfluous either. So beautiful. Lovely girls, you made beautiful and delicious cocktails, but you didn't think about my granddaughter's health at all. I will make a cocktail that will be primarily useful. It will consist of different vegetables, which I will stuff into this blender. And the more it comes, the better. The only stuff is to mix it all and it's ready. Ah, oh, what a smell. Terrible. Yeah, that's right. Oh, man! Come on. My granddaughter will appreciate my concern for her health. Is that right? It's time to choose a winner. Yay! Well, in appearance, all the cocktails are very nice. Grandma's cocktail looks the most common. So let's start with it. Ew. Ew. I hate it. I hope it tastes better. Oh, terrible! I don't like it, Grandma! Next one is Enid's cocktail. It looks much tastier. Oh, I just love whipped cream. And there's so much of it here. I don't need to drink your cocktail. It has to be eaten with a spoon. Ah, oh, so good. Creams? Over. Now? The tube. Strange. Why is the cocktail so thick? It's impossible to drink it. Oh, how can I give the victory to a cocktail that I haven't even tasted? Hmm, it's definitely past. No. Wednesday, I'll hop as in you. I will try it right away. Mmm, finally yummy. I would love to drink this cocktail on a regular basis because it's really delicious. Nah, I just can't stop. Mmm, and whipped cream on top. And who is the winner? Well, it's obvious now. Wednesday, she made a very cool cocktail. Congratulations. Granddaughter, what task awaits us in this round? Woo! Granny, it's very simple. Make a salad for me. I want something light. Lettuce, well, so be it. Yeah! Granddaughter, a couple of minutes and it's ready. Okay. Oh, there will be a salad for you. I've just ripened the leaves for the salad. Let it form the basis of the salad. These cheese and crackers will be used too. Apparently even I know the recipe for the Caesars, of course. And don't forget about tomatoes. They will be decoration of the salad and its taste. And it's ready. 
great! I've figured out how to make a salad not just delicious but also beautiful. I will return to the theme of flowers again and make small but very cute flowers out of vegetables. I will also have suitable molds. In my opinion, this is a great idea because it looks like a real bouquet. And it's also a delicious salad. Oh, what flowers. It's boring. The salad lacks something dark. At least a couple of basil lips, for example. I'm delighted with this skull, so it's also going to be on the plate. It is on the skull that I will stick all their ingredients, cheese and ham. Now, you need to pour out ketchup over the whole thing. And so two eyes. The skull begins to look much more interesting. What a horror! If I saw it on the night like this, I would fall in fear. Okay, baby, let's try. Hooray! Finally delicious food! Wednesday, what have you cooked this time? Oh, what a horror! I've never seen such terrible salads. Oh, I can't eat it because it's creepy. Let's see how my grandmother will surprise me. Her salad is really very similar to Caesar. Hmm, here's the salad I'm ready to eat all the time. I don't even want to stop. I want to empty the plate as soon as possible. Here is the truth and tasty and healthy. I will be unrealistically strong now. But before that, I'll try flowers from Enid. Ew, it's just vegetables, not tasty at all. But I really like grandma salad. Congratulations. Hey. Grandma, don't distract me. The baby's ready to give a task. I want a donut for dessert. You'll have a donut. I like them too. So I can cook it too. I imagine how boring and quiet the donuts will turn out. Why is that? In general, the main thing is that they're delicious. They're not going to look at donuts at all. I'll do something bright again. More precisely, each of my donuts will be its own color. Usually people like this approach. Uh, what was that? Don't touch me. Don't distract me from cooking. My donuts are almost ready. Part of the job is done. It's now time to decorate. Of course, where to go without blood syrup? Oh, actually, red syrup. But it's not all. With the help of white syrup, I'm going to draw some webs. It's like they're right from the spider's cobweb. Thing. Hey! I need Nutella. Bring it to me. Come on! Good job. I wouldn't do anything without your help. Look at my bats. The hat? We don't need it. Look at my really beautiful donuts. Oh, unusual. <laughs> I don't want these things. They are just going to be original, and for it to be more delicious, I'm just gonna pour some sugar powder. Oh, uh, my granddaughter will be delighted. My colorful donuts are also ready. They're so beautiful. You can even make photos with them. Cool, right? But that's not it. With these donuts? The perfect thing to go is sprinkles, but I have to open the jar. Uh, uh. Oops, I poured some in my mouth. <laughs> so much fun. Well, baby, it's your time to try. Yay! <laughs> oh, interesting. Oh, Wednesday did something scary again. Oh, but they look delicious. Hmm, hmm not bad. But to be honest, okay. I expected more. Right. Oh, next ones are Granny's Donuts. Before eating them, I want to make a huge tower. Awesome. It's going to be more convenient to eat them like that. Mmm, <laughs> just regular donuts. Nothing special. Well, let's see what Enid did. Whoa, her donuts are the most similar to the ones I drew. Oh, this is unrealistically delicious! Enid! It's very obvious! You're the winner! Guys, focus on baby Brittany! She's giving you the first task! I want pancakes! No problem! Easy. What? Oh, have we started? Uh, yes, I'll make pancakes, bud! Why, oh, sweet? I just have zucchini in the fridge! Why waste food? 
Grandma, I'm not sure that baby Brittany wants such pancakes. Why is that? We'll see. Mixing everything and the dough is ready. It remains only to fry it. It looks really cool. They're so green and smell fresh. And it, do you like it? Oh, you don't understand anything. I will make delicious sweet pancakes that baby Brittany will definitely like. But we need to open this jar of milk. Oh, what a nightmare. Ah! Oh no, I'm covered in milk. <laughs> but okay, it's fixable. It's good that milk is left. Enough for a couple of pancakes for baby Brittany. And we're going to make colorful pancakes. I think it's worth trying to do. We'll mix everything and pour it in plates. Arm ourselves with dice and color the dough. Wow, it turned out so bright and beautiful. I hope the pancakes will remain as bright. It remains only to cook them. Hooray! Here's my mountain of rainbow pancakes ready. Now we take a pastry bag with cream. And let's do this. Some ears. And eyes. And of course, a golden horn. That's a unicorn pancake. Do not forget about magical sprinkles. Or like sweet sprinkles. Ready! It's so appetizing and beautiful. Awesome. Baby Brittany will be thrilled. What? From this colored mess? Now I'm going to make my best pancakes. Hand recently almost swallowed its tongue when eating them. Okay. Of course, I'll make black pancakes. It's very practical. If you burn something, no one will notice. It remains to turn it over. Grandma? Oh, granddaughter! Goodness, black pancakes! Did she put earth in them? My pancakes are beautiful, fresh, and green. They not only taste natural and healthy, but also look great. No pancakes will help you anymore. My pancakes look just great. And they look even better with white cream. With which I'll dry a web and a spider. Isn't it cool? Well, everyone is ready. Baby Brittany, time for you to try. I'm always ready. But I don't want to try these pancakes, but let's see. Ugh, it's not good at all! Oh, you don't get it! Oh, and we have something interesting here. Looks creepy, so Wednesday did it. Let's try. Hmm, actually much tastier than grandma's. Look how gorgeous it is! This is exactly what I wanted. It's small and a rainbow. It's a unicorn! What a charm! It tastes amazing! I really like it! These pancakes win! Congratulations to Annette on her first victory! Love you! Don't be upset, guys! <laughs> the baby is already finishing drawing. Let's see what does she want. I want cacao! And don't forget about marshmallows! Everyone is ready. And it. Oh, come on! You're funny. Oh. I want to start doing it as soon as possible to finish the first. Let's get some milk. After all, cacao without milk is not cacao at all. I want to complicate the recipe a little. I believe that cacao can be made from Mars chocolates. Do you think so too? Let's wait. Cacao from Heartful Bars? It's not cacao, it's sugar on sugar! Now I'll show you the real cacao that I drank in my childhood! Warming everything up and adding some chocolates! Well, kids love something sweet! And my favorite mug! And it don't take it! Let's pour it in! Perfect! And I will have colored cacao! Look what delicious chocolates I found! I need to arrange the chocolates on plates, pour milk, and add a little spark. Now I'm going to melt everything! Yeah, that's way faster! See? Everything is ready! I got a very nice colored cacao! Cool! Cool! What a nightmare. 
Hand, help me arrange a prank. You need to change the label on the jar with the inscription salt to sugar. I believe in you. Thanks, Hand. You're a real devoted servant. Cool. Oh, I definitely need some sugar. We'll add it to each plate with colored cacao to make it very sweet. I think that's enough. Pouring it in and… Some whipped cream. Awesome! Voila! Right. The main ingredient is marshmallows. Adding it. We insert a unicorn and a straw. Ready? Yeah. How do you like it? <laughs> Not really? Man. You don't get it. Wait a minute. I'll take this mu oh no, this one. It is shaved as a skull because I don't like pink. Pouring hot cacao in some whipped cream. And of course we do not forget about decor. I think the marmalades in the form of bats and strawberry syrup will look perfect with this mug. I have everything ready. Just look at how dark it is. Cool. Oh, I think Wednesday scared grandma and added. Although, not surprising. I see that you're ready. I'm always ready. Everything looks so good at… Ugh, this is not good at salty! A nightmare! <laughs> cool! Oh, this is definitely from grandma. And it's really good! And what do we have here? Wednesday, I recognize you. Did you give me your best mug? Let's see. It's so good! Victory goes to Wednesday. Congratulations, Wednesday. Are you already dancing the victory dance? Let's all do it together. I want a burger. Will you do it? I'm hungry. It'll be done. Of course. Oh, I'm going to need minced meat for this cutlet. <laughs> and here are the buns. Grandma! Oh, what should I take? Oh, right, a tomato. Oh, Grandma, stop! But I still have a sweet donut. I'm going to make a burger out of it. And you make it out of your nasty meat. I'll cut the donut in half. And I want to use pink Nutella as a sauce. It must be super sweet. I also love Nutella. So, let's see. Oh, marshmallows. That's much better. Putting it on a donut, and let's not forget about the sour sauce. It'll fit just perfectly. It's sour and beautiful. Oh, Grandma, do you want to try it? Anna decided to prank Granny with sour candy. Grandma, be careful. Oh, you've upset grandma. Okay, we had a laugh. And now let's continue cooking. Pour the sauce and then add the chocolate. It'll be the most beautiful burger. Also with my favorite rainbow marmalades. Looks so cool. <laughs> Anid, your burger is really great and interesting. That's just the others are not thrilled, but what would you do? I already have an idea. Definitely won't take this. I want to take fish. A fish burger. This is an amazing idea. Wednesday, can you be a little more careful? Although you can cut everything beautifully and smoothly even with your eyes closed. Some eggs. For what? Now you'll find out. I'm going to break two eggs in a saucepan. Add cottage cheese. And let's wait. I've just got a great stove flying around here. <laughs> Don't be jealous. I'll put some oil and let's cook it. Closing the lid and some buns. Cool. Some tomato. Oh, the buns are ready and they're very hot. Holding on to ketchup. Some lettuce leaves. A cutlet, cheese, and tomato. Perfect. With love from Granny. I have an omelet ready. I'm putting red fish on black black bun. We put eggs on top. Then a couple of cucumber slices for freshness. We close everything with a black black bun. 
Now we take my favorite kitchen gadget, with which I can cut tomatoes in no time. All done. Where's my Cheetos? Oh, Anid, you okay. shouldn't have eaten Wednesday's food. It seems that hand will teach you a lesson now. Take care. Oh, you parasite! Oh, get out! Anid, get him the Cheetos. Oh, looks like a fight is coming. Sit down comfortably and stock up on popcorn. Anid, you've lost. Give them the Cheetos. Thanks, hand. How long did you train the punch? The Cheetos are too bright, so I'll paint it with which color? Of course, black. It looks much better. Adding the Cheeto paws to my burger, and everything is ready. Baby Brittany is going to be difficult, but are you ready? All the burgers are cool, and this sweet one is incredible! It has my favorite marshmallows! So sweet! Well done, Enid. Wow, is that a monster burger? Is it a crab or a spider? Ew, fish! I don't like that! And this one looks the way I wanted it. I'll try it. Grandma always knew how to please me. This is the best of them all! It's the winner! Oh, goodness, thank you so much! Hold down, don't touch anything! In the first round, prepare delicious pancakes for me. It'll be done. <laughs> Easily. The hand will help me. Okay. Of course, granddaughter. Who besides grandma will cook delicious pancakes for you? Nobody. I've been baking them for you since you were a baby. I know the best recipe. Mm. How delicious it smells. Just perfect. Ordinary pancakes are boring. Hand, bring me some cacao. With it, pancakes will not only taste better, but also be darker. So, pancakes will immediately become much more beautiful. It'll be much more pleasant to eat them. Okay. Frying it. And the first pancake is ready. I'll keep baking these goodies. <laughs> Wednesday? Is that it again? Even trying to make pancakes, Tar? Rainbow, what are you doing? Okay, it's time for me to cook a very tasty pancake. It'll also have an unusual color. Only not black, but colored. Strange. Why is this pancake matron not squeezing out? <gasps> Ow! Oh, in the eye! No big deal. By the way, it's very tasty. What a cute unicorn! Oh, it really is cute. Good job. I hope your pancakes will be at least as delicious as mine. By the way, I've already baked a whole mountain of pancakes. And some butter on top. It's also nice to add some maple syrup. I know my granddaughter adores it. Very much. My pancakes are almost ready too. Additionally, I'll pour strawberry syrup on them. Look how creepy it looks. And a couple of spiders won't be super flues either. What a nightmare! These pancakes really look very creepy. Let's see which pancakes our judge will like. All the pancakes look very appetizing. But the unicorn pancakes looks the funniest. Let's see how it tastes like. Amazing! I like it a lot. Now I'm going to try grandma's signature pancakes. Let's see. They are, as always, unreal! And the last ones are left. How scary they are! Ah! These are spiders! Wednesday, don't you know I'm afraid of them? Therefore, I'll immediately get these insects off my pancakes. Now I can find out how delicious they are. Mmm! They are very nice, but it's very difficult to choose the winner. After all, grannies are always the best, so this is the winner. Girls, don't be offended. Someday you'll be lucky too. And now, I want you to cook me some french fries. I love that. Oh, fried potatoes often. Hint, 
Don't get in the way. I need to peel potatoes. Hey! Oh, uh, uh, Rainbow! You're bothering us! What? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't hear anything because of the drill. I'll be more careful from now on. Anyway, my potatoes are almost peeled. It remains to cut it well. You need to be careful because the slices should look exactly like french fries. And I did it. But why not make french fries of different colors? <laughs> it's very beautiful. Besides, it's original. Bravo, Rainbow! You're as always amazing! It is time for oil. Why are you pouring so much? Okay. Grandma, thank you for your help. The first batch of potatoes is already done. You just need to arrange all the slices beautifully on a plate. There we go. It looks incredible. It's frying time for me, too. I'll add some oil. And of course, the stove needs to be made hotter. Now you can also dump potatoes into the oil. This should be done carefully so as not to get burnt. Hmm. One day, can I borrow some ketchup? I'll take a bit. Thank you. Well, my french fries are almost ready. It remains only to put it on a plate. My granddaughter will be delighted. There we go. Even I'm absolutely delighted here. And why are you so happy? Now I'll show you what real french fries are. Hand, bring it, black hand. Oh, dang it. Oh, no. I always forget that you need to spray the other side, but okay. I'm going to paint the potatoes black anyway. <sighs> By the way, I'll do this with the help of food coloring. Hint. Thanks for your help. Okay, you can take the can away. Now my task is to arrange the potatoes beautifully. I'm almost sure that this is my potatoes that will win this round. Some ketchup. Great. <laughs> How beautiful everything is! Where should I start? Perhaps the first one will be Wednesday's potatoes. She did something dark again. I hope it's at least delicious. Mmm! I really like it! It's so delicious that I just can't stop! I want to eat everything at once! Mm, it's a pity that there are no more left. Bravo! It's very good! Well, it's time to try grandma's potatoes. And it's also incredibly delicious! You're such good fellows! And I love french fries so much that I'm already eating them! Oh, the last one! Why can't you eat only french fries? And the third one's from Rainbow! Let's see how delicious it is! Oh yeah! It is not only delicious, but also very beautiful! I'll eat it all at once as well! Uh, I've eaten too much. Homie! Ah! Girls, we ball one. What a terrible hand Wednesday has. Just awful. This time, I want a burger. I hope you won't disappoint me. Okay. It'll be done. Easy. Okay. I haven't cooked burgers yet, but I think there's nothing complicated about it. Where's the knife? Here it is. <laughs> Wednesday, please be careful with the knife. These are no toys. Well, you need to cut the bun in half. And fry each half in a frying pan. <laughs> After that, you can start cooking the cutlet. It does not matter at all whether it turns out to be smooth or not. The main thing is that this is really delicious. And a little cheese won't hurt. Now you can start making the burger. A bun, a lettuce leaf, color with cheese, and a little sauce. Ta-da! The burger is ready. No. Cool. Now it's my turn. Hey, can't catch a bun. Oh, I, I think I scared it. Didn't mean to. No more frying pan. It's okay. 
I'm going to cook my signature sweet burger for Cindy. She'll definitely be absolutely delighted with it. Instead of buns, I'm using donuts, some chocolate on top, and moving on. Some delicious sauce. This is actually so sour but so good! And now, some marshmallows and marmalades. Strawberry syrup. And I'll cover the burger with another part of the donut. There's so much sugar! I plan to outdo us all and make more than just a burger. It'll be a burger in the form of a head. First, I need to fry cutlet, big and juicy. I will use, of course, black buns, on which I'll put a piece of cheese. Cheese, by the way, should be cut as I show. I'll make two holes in the top bun. And bring me some mustard. Some holes. And now, I'm gonna put mustard in there. And you better hurry up. Okay. Pouring it right in. Now, I'll make a tongue from a cucumber. And the rest of the ingredients. Some sauce on top. The burger is almost ready. It remains only to insert the ice on toothpicks into it. Look at what creepy had. It's ready to devour everyone. Cindy, hurry up and eat it. How cool! Oh. Wednesday, you're scaring me again! By the way, the burger looks cool. Are those marmalade eyes? They are the very ones. I love them! Now let's see what the burger itself tastes like. The idea to make it in the shape of a hat is just brilliant! Very tasty! I'm thrilled! But in order to not overeat, I'll move on to the next participant. Let's see what grandma has prepared for me. Your burger, of course. It's delicious. But it's kind of ordinary. I was waiting for more. Let's see what Rainbow has done. Her burger looks unreal. I think it's delicious. Delicious but still sweet. And I went to have lunch, so Wednesday wins this round. Finally. I knew that victory would come. I am thirsty this time. Surprise me with a cocktail. I can surprise you. It'll be done. A cocktail, you say? I'll try it. And don't bother me. Well, how are these fancy milkshakes being prepared there? Apparently, first you need to use milk. But it will be better if you melt a whole chocolate bar in it. Let's put it in and stir it well. <laughs> I'll serve the cocktail in a branded mug. I hope Cindy will be happy. I know she likes cacao, so I hope she likes mine. Plain cacao is boring. Why not make a cocktail according to a more cool recipe? First, I need a bar of white chocolate. I'll take a bite and melt the rest of milk. White chocolate won't turn a cocktail into brown goo. Now, a little sugar. Just a little? Of course. The main thing is that it is delicious. Now you can add some milk. Oh, ouch! Oh! oh! Got a little dirty, but okay. The milk is delicious, so that means I'm delicious too. To make my cocktail brighter, I'll drop some food coloring. It'll be very beautiful. Let's stir it now. Perfect. You can also experiment with the feeling. For example, why not serve a cocktail in a decorated jar? I think Cindy will appreciate such a gesture. Pouring it in. Now it's time to add some whipped cream, because it'll definitely not be superfluous. Everyone loves it, even me. And don't forget about marshmallows. 
Now, a straw. Ready. Cool. Wednesday. Oh, okay. I will also make a very original cocktail. Firstly, it will be in a cool mug in the form of a skull. Now, some strawberry syrup. It will look great. And then, I'll pour the usual cacao inside. But I still also assemblish it with whipped cream, so it'll be a little more interesting. I also have marmalades in the form of bats. Cindy will definitely like it. Ready. Cindy, it's time to pick the winner. Hmm. Wednesday, let's start with your cocktail. It looks terrifying again. I'm definitely not going to eat this creepy marmalades. Delicious, bud. Yeah. Looks like the most ordinary cacao. Let's see what grandma has prepared. She has the cutest mug of all. Whoa. And cacao again. Too easy. Rainbow's cocktail looks much more interesting. I hope I'll be delighted with it. Wow, so many toppings! There, this is a real cocktail! Rainbow, this time the victory is yours! Baby's already finishing her drawing. What do you want to eat? Oh, she wants pancakes! Will you make it for her? Is everyone ready? In it, don't waste the dog, just like that! Wednesday's ready and grandma, well, she's ready too! Let's get started! So my dog is ready. I knew that I would have to cook branded pancakes. Now let's make a stack and feed my beloved granddaughter. Mmm, what a smell. Voila, ready. Now we will add something sweet so that baby will definitely like it. Let's add my favorite maple syrup and more butter on top. And I'll have rainbow pancakes. It turns out I have doll of all colors of the rainbow. Oh, uh, blue, come on. Pour out. Hello. What? Hello. Ouch. I'm all covered in doll. Everything is fine. Don't worry. I'll wipe it now. Ready to keep cooking. Here. The first pancake. Perfect. What a rainbow without a unicorn, right? Oh, I'm done. Grandma, what do you think? Hooray! What's the matter with you? Oh, I can't find my black dye. Oh, it's not here. Thing? Oh, already here. And you brought my dye. Thank you. Great. Drop a few drops, and we're done. Now we put the dye into the syringe. It's so much more convenient to draw like that. Now I'm settling a terrible, frightening spider web and a spider. Ah, oh, how cute. Mm, so good. Look at these spiders. Decorate the plate with fresh blood. Oh, strawberry syrup, I mean. Spread the web and my cute spiders. A masterpiece. Whoa, Wednesday, it turned out scary and delicious. Delicious, right? So appetizing. Is everyone ready? Baby, try it soon while it's hot. So what do we have here? How beautiful everything is. Oh, these are real spiders? Oh, goodies. Oh, it's a pancake. Wednesday decided to scare me again. Maybe it will taste better than it looks. Spiders are cute and not at all scary when edible. Delicious! What's next? Oh, a whole bunch of pancakes with syrup! Mmm, it's going to be delicious! We need to try! Delicious, sweet! Mmm, yummy! What's next? Whoa, it's a unicorn pancake and a rainbow! Huh? Whee! Fly up, my unicorn, and fly into my mouth! Mmm, <laughs> magical! Yes. All right, all right, all the right. unicorn pancakes take the victory! Congratulations! Enid, congratulations! I want french fries! Will you do it for me? 
first. Okay. I'm so hungry. Oh, baby, don't worry. Professionals with experience work in the kitchen. Yeah, Grandma? Yes, that's exactly right. Ah, uh, what's going on? Ah, oh, come on, we're all covered in peel. Can you be more careful? Aw, oh, Enid, sunshine, can you be more careful? Aw, oh, you're so cute. Do you need help? Okay, let's take it out. Ugh, see? <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. Now I'm going to cut it with a special knife. Look what a beautiful potato. Curly. A crazy idea came to my mind. I want to make colored potatoes. Isn't it cool? I'm going to have some cool rainbow potatoes. Look, baby has definitely not seen it yet. Ready? Now we need to fry it. A little more oil. Now let's fry it. Cool, right? It's so easy for me. I think I'm going to become a chef soon. Imagine me being in a chef's hat. Oh, and what if it's rainbow colored? Oh, my potatoes are ready. In it, you're so good. It turned out very well. I'm already frying my potatoes, too. I got ordinary potatoes, not colored, but also very tasty and crispy. Uh, -oh. uh it's hard to stop. Let's pour some ketchup. Ah, uh, yummy. And my potatoes are already ready, too. You can put it out. Now I'm going to color it. Oops, I got a little dirty. Black suits me, of course, but I'm not ready for a new style yet. I wanted to paint the potatoes black, not myself. I have real potatoes from hot hell. Now, the only thing left is to make the final touch. Voila, you didn't think it would be just black potato, right? It's Klaus. Baby, the potatoes are ready. Wow, what a beautiful potato! And Wednesday decided to scare me again. But I'm not afraid anymore. It's a bunch of potatoes. Wow, super delicious. I can't stop. Ah, and what do we have here? Oh, it's a regular potato with ketchup. But it's not bad either. Mmm, very, very, very tasty. Mmm, extremely delicious. Yes. <sighs> but this immediately attracts a lot of attention. It's a rainbow fries. I've only seen this in my dreams. Mmm, my teeth are stained. Look. <laughs> I'm full. Uh oh. But rainbow potatoes will win. Wow, Enid, you've won again. Congratulations, well done. The baby is already finishing drawing. What is it this time? She wants a burger. Wow, is everyone ready? Of course we're ready. I'll make the best burger in the baby's life. Now I'll fry the buns. Add sweet tomato, necessarily cut in rings. And of course, minced meat. It is very important to make cutlets from minced meat. So, you can start rolling the cutlet. Bun, green salad fresh, a juicy cutlet on top of it, cheese, tomato, and the bun cover everything up. Hooray, I have everything ready. <laughs> Oh, come on, Enid. This is a simple sandwich. Don't praise me. So, I have an idea, too. These buns look so, well, fine. But I'll take something tastier. Donut. I'll add strawberry syrup on top. Sweet. In my burger, the main thing is a lot of sweets. Baby loves everything sour, sweet, and delicious. I will do it. Candy is the most important thing. <laughs> All right. So, the only thing left is to add marshmallows. Mmm, delicious. How delicious and sweet. Whoa, I want to eat the sugar ball myself. Cover it. Ready. Uh-oh. Oh, so here are my black buns ready. Now we'll put cheese on it. 
a red meat patty. We need more cheese and more blood. That's it, right, ketchup. So now you can cover it with another bun. And don't forget about the finishing touches. Chips, but not for me. For a burger, they will serve as a cool tongue for my monster burger. Thing, I need your help. Yes, come on, he's not even going to eat you. He doesn't even have a mouth. Do you want to take my marmalade ice? Hey, I wanted them so much. Thanks, Thing. You got me marmalade eyes. They suit you too. But right now, I need them more for my burger. I got an awfully cute burger. Ready for the tasting? Mmm, the burgers look great! Which one should I start with? Oh, I'll start with this weird one. It's funny. Oh, and very tasty. Nice. What's next? Yes! Okay. All right. This burger looks like I drew it. It definitely has to be good. We're trying. Ew, onion? I don't like onions. I won't try it again. Okay, is that a sweet burger from Enid? Oh, so cool. So sweet and delicious. I can't choose, come on. Victory goes to Wednesday. Mmm, even marmalade eyes on top. I love it. Wednesday, congratulations. Does that make you happy? Wow, come on. Wednesday, smile wider with your teeth. Okay, you have such a beautiful smile. I want cocoa. Will you make it for me? Is everyone ready? Yeah. Cool, I hope that everything will be delicious and baby right, will like right, it. Right. Who will start? Ah, now I'm going to mix cocoa and milk in a saucepan. It should turn out super delicious. Let's add some chocolate. Mmm. Chocolate drink. So my cocoa can only be in a mug with my face. That's better. Let everyone know who is number one here. Grandma, you really are the best. But I will definitely have cocoa no worse than yours. I found some very delicious chocolates. Now I'll add some sugar in the frying pan. And of course, just a little bit of sugar, right? No, I'm not listening to you, Grandma. Okay, we need some milk. Oh, come on, open. Ouch! I spilled some? Well, it's fine. Okay. There's enough for cocoa. Okay, I can't leave it just white. Now we're gonna add some coloring. Looks so beautiful. Mmm, the yellow cream will come in handy. Now we'll make delicious streaks. And not forget about the bright sprinkles. And let's pour it with our cocoa. Cool, right? I think it's just super. Baby will be delighted. More sweets and decorations. How do you like that? Yay, cool. <laughs> A straw with rainbow. I'm done. Oh, thing. Have you seen this color madness? Who am I only working next to? I think you understand what kind of cocoa I'm going to make. I'll pour cocoa dark as oil into my favorite glass. Add brightening ornaments and worms. Put marmalade worms. We will not frighten much. Ready. Hmm. Nice. Once everyone's ready, then we try. Baby, are you ready? Oh yeah, I'm always ready. Everything looks very appetizing. This cocoa is so bright. It was definitely prepared by Enid. Delicious. Oh, this is my beloved grandmother's cocoa. Haha, <laughs> look at the cup. Mmm, cocoa from grandma is always delicious. Oh, it's Wednesday again. Her favorite skulls. Let's try it. Mmm, marmalades and cocoa. They're delicious. But I have to choose one thing, and I choose this. Great, let's start with cookies. Easy as pie. I'll do it. I can't promise anything, but I'll try. How to deal with it? What is the circle for? Probably unnecessary details. Oh dear, what are you doing? 
Look at how it's supposed to be done. Roll it in smooth movements, then cut out the circles and put the blanks on a baking sheet. Get into the oven, future cookies. I can do anything. An idea. Cookies are round, right? So you can just cut a circle out of the dough and not bother. And the most important ingredient is Kittles. I don't mind having a snack with such cookies myself. You did a good job, honey. And how are my cookies? Without exaggeration, as always, perfect. I will leave no comments. Here are my cookies. This is a work of art. The master's hand is immediately visible. Just look at what an amazing gingerbread house I have. By the way, thanks for the idea. I'll decorate the roof with Skittles. Well, the final touch. Powdered sugar. And my house seems to be dusted with a snowball. I can't believe my eyes. Darling, these are not for you. Oh no! Looks like a small fire! We need to get cookies urgently! Maybe it can still be saved! Oh no! There doesn't seem to be anything to be done here! And these are cookies? I'm not sure you can eat it at all! Well, well, what do we have here? Wow! A gingerbread house! So beautiful and so delicious! Mm. I think this house has one. Yeah! And it couldn't be otherwise. I'm a professional. <laughs> and now I want a burger. Let's and quickly. Go. Okay. Yeah! I can do it. Although, maybe not. Is that mine, meat? Oh, what an abomination. I know. Instead of this nasty mice meat, you can use a delicious and appetizing chocolate taste. It is turning out great. Perfect. How are others doing? Such perfect buns. But you need to fry them. A rubby crust will be very useful. Hmm. What do you know about a rubby crust, Grandma? One, two, and the burger is almost done. Impressive. But the most important thing in a burger is a juicy patty. I'll borrow my meat. Thanks. And now you need to put the future patty in the pan and wait a little. My goodness! Honey, what are you up to? Calm down, Grandma. I have everything under control. I just decided to fry marshmallows and add piquancy to my burger. And now it's the turn of marmalades. Roll on top and press harder. That's the whole recipe. How do you like it? Why this rivalry if I still make the most delicious burger? Just look at these patties. I'll add more bacon. There's never too much meat. And now it remains only to lay out the vegetables and cheese in layers. I agree that one layer is very boring. But if you make a lot of layers, <laughs> it'll be what you need. Yes, I'm a clear favorite here. It turned out absolutely great. Well, no, I'm not going to lose. Carefully lay out the ingredients. And now, sauces. There is no need to stint. We're doing it from the heart. What a cute <laughs> burger. A little more and I'll achieve a golden crust. Oh dear, something is not okay. Come on, Grandma, look how great I did. ta -da! Wow, what's the size? A three-story burger is something I want to try fast. Mm, how juicy it is, amazing. Now you, my friend. Oh, everything fell apart. Okay, because there's another burger. It looks very appetizing. Let's try. Mmm, marmalade. And Nutella. Great, but the chef's burger wins. 
Congratulations! Yes. Well, you know, it's not fair anymore. This time, I want nuggets. Will you be able to do it? Easy. Okay. Grandma, wake up! Look, Jennifer wants nuggets. Okay. Oh, of course. First, you need to pour a little oil into the pen. Hmm. Oh, Granny, will you share oil with me? Thanks. Strange, why isn't it pouring? Probably need to shake harder. Oh, come on! Oops. Something clearly went wrong. Oh dear, who doesn't like that? Okay. The main thing is that it is delicious. And to make it always delicious, I cook with love. The chicken needs to be marinated. To do this, beat an egg, dip chicken pieces in it, and then roll them in crackers. Great. Now you can fry it. So delicious. Mm, and what a smell. Don't you want to try it, chef? Um, no. I have something to do. My nuggets will be out of the highest class. They will look like pieces of gold. And of course, serving is also an art. It should be spectacular. I know. When you don't want to bother with cooking, you can take a pre-made one. I'll wrap the nuggets in cheese, and then I'll make the most delicious breadcrumbs from Cheetos. To do this, I'll beat this pack well. Honey, be careful. Not so hard. Oh, It seems to have worked. We'll see. Yes, great. Now let's add Cheetos to the nuggets and put them in the pan. I already feel this amazing taste. Don't even want to give it to the baby. I almost forgot. Well, what kind of nuggets without ketchup? Now it is perfect. Oh my gosh! How cool it looks! Are these golden nuggets? They taste the most ordinary. Okay, I'll try the next one. Yes, I like these ones much more. But there is still some left. Red ones. Great. Mmm. There's Cheetos here, too. This is definitely the winner. Hooray! I'm won! Have you seen it? Have you seen it? Victory! Can you make pizza? I want it. No problem. I wouldn't mind it myself. Ah, oh, pizza. I can do that. Tomato paste is needed here. We drip a little on a piece and gently smear it with a spoon. And now the cheese. The more cheese, the tastier. And pepperoni. Um, I don't want to distract, but… Oh. Look, I'm a chef flying down! Oh, it did oh. fly. Oh, no. Don't be upset, dear. Here, take a new piece. <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. Oh, I know. No boring tomato paste. But a marshmallow paste. I'll scoop up a whole spoonful like that. And now on to pizza. And of course, Skittles. They're never extra. Well, I'm almost done. Yes, you can immediately see the hand of non-professionals. My pizza will be the healthiest. No boring white dough. I'll make it more spectacular by painting it black. Oh, just look at that. I can do more than that. And now we roll out the base. The base should be smeared with a special tomato sauce. Then the pizza will be as delicious as in the best Italian restaurants. I'll put some cheese on top. Excellent. And now it's shrimp time. And so that they're not alone, I'll add muscle girlfriends. The high cuisine dish is done. Get ready to enjoy. Oh, how long it's gonna take? Oh, I think it's done. Perfect. Let's try the pizzas. Bellissimo. Oh, so good. Oh, quite good. We'll see, we'll see. How interesting it looks. Ew, what is that? Oh, are those real muscles? I'm not gonna try it. 
But this is more interesting. Looks like Skittles. Um, it looks better than it tastes. Oh, but this pizza looks completely normal. And it smells so good. Mmm, what an amazing taste! Yes, it's the winner! Congratulations, Grandma! Oh, a well-deserved victory! My pizza was better. No comments. <laughs> Have your attention, please! First of all, I want to eat a juicy steak! Easy! I'll do it. No problem. I'll make the most delicious steak. And the fastest to you. We'll see about that. Wow. The chief is already on the case. Then I'll keep up to you. What's he doing there, butter? It couldn't be easier. I can't even pour it without looking. Careful, honey. You can't play with groceries. Okay, what can they cook? It's just me. With my great skills, I'm sure to win. I can do it too. All you have to do is just a stag up high. Oh. I forgot to catch it. Friends, son. You need to be a little more careful. Watch. Carefully pull this steak on the pan. Turn it over. And you get a golden crust. My crust is even more golden than yours. Hey, hey look! Second jam! Where's the mid? Um. Uh, just give me a second. Oh, no. The meat is dirty. How can you eat it? Uh, oh. oh, I know! <laughs> if you put a ketchup on the steak, you can see the dirt is perfect! <laughs> mm, yes, grandson, you're no cook. And my steak was perfect. Well, and all I have to do is pepper and decorate it with a sprig of rosemary. Hmm. No, 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 grandma, you don't know anything about serving. Old. What can be better than a golden steak? <laughs> Nothing. Because I cooked it. And now, use some salt. And I'm done. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Let's try it. What the hell is that? You're trying to poison me? Alex, your work? No hmm. way I'm eating that. Okay. That steak looks delicious. <laughs> Let's try it. Mm, amazing! Oh, oh the last one? Oh, is it cool? Uh, Honestly, it tastes like I don't even want to finish it. Here's our winner! I won. That's great. Well, what's next? And now it's time for dessert. I want a croissant. Oh, easy. <laughs> I hope I can win this time. Oh. Uh oh, wow. Grandma's really good at this. She's good billets. Why don't you share them with me, too, Granny? Okay. Oh, thank you. Yay. All that's left to do is pull the croissants in the oven, and it's almost ready. Oh, no. That's not for me. Real professionals don't use convenience foods, only fresh products. Need a job? It's almost ready. Now we roll it out. All this done? Yeah, like this. And add some butter and cut it so that the croissants are perfectly shaped. And now we put it in the oven. Oh my god. Awesome. Cool. Oh, <gasps> wow, Grandma! <laughs> have you had a tell with this whole time? And you haven't said anything? It's the perfect adding to my croissants. Yum, 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 I like it. <laughs> time to get the croissants out. Don't take too long, grandson, or they're lured. What's that spell? Indeed. What? Oh no! My croissants! They're burned. What's the matter? Oh, no. Now it's just two curls. I certainly won't appreciate it. Don't get so upset. You'll win again. No, there's only one winner here, and that's me. And here are my champion croissants. All that's left is to serve them beautifully. And whipped cream, and there is. 
and a little powder. It's done. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Hmm. Um, uh, Coles? Yeah. Alex, do you try to poison me again? No way. Huh? This grill sounds so pretty appetizing. Oh, and they're tasty. Nice. Not bad. <gasps> the beautiful croissants. And delicious. Mm. My gosh, just awesome. This is definitely a winner. Justice mm. has Thank finally you. been Very served. Hmm. Attention, please. I wouldn't say no to another dessert. Okay. Okay, easy. Grandma, stay awake. Uh oh. Um, what did I miss? Pancakes. Um, uh, uh, this is uh, this is easy. Oh, the battery's perfect. That means the pancakes will be perfect. Here comes the first one. Already done. Oh, I like it. No. Uh, duh, like duh. What's so special about it? Oh. Oh, idea. I can make it special. I can add coloring. And make the world's most colorful pancakes. Uh -huh. Great idea. Yay. The first pancake is ready. Just a few more to bake. <laughs> One, two, three. Great. Oh, all that's dressing is a bit of butter. And of course, a uh, maple syrup. How appetizing is that? Mm. You nice. bet it is. Mm. I need to do something to spruce up my pancakes. I know, marshmallow paste will do. Off with the lid. Oh. Delicious. Yes. This is where it belongs. Yeah. On my wedding pancakes. And now the sprinkles. Super. Wow. Well done, grandson. Oh no, I'm not going to give up my win. I have a secret oh. recipe. Firstly, the egg. Greens and sausage. That's it. And bacon. And hard boiled poached eggs. The perfect pancakes are ready. <laughs> Let's give them a try. I'll start with this. They smell great. Hmm. Um, what about this ones? Oh, they are so colorful and cheerful. Yummy. Oh, they are good too. Cool. Um, hmm. what about the third? They look weird. But I need to give them a no. chance. But uh, no, I don't want. And awesome. here's the winner. Yay, yeah. victory is mine. Super. You're doing such a great job! <laughs> can I make ice cream? The sheep can do anything. Okay. No problem. That's all it takes. This time, I'm going to have the best and most delicious ice cream ever. For this one, properly sling the cake. Wow. Oh. Just need to break it. Oh, be careful, grandson. Right in the eye. Sorry. Oh, look. Oh, Chief's cooking is the full swing over there. While you're pimpering yourselves, the world's most delicious ice cream Yummy. is in full swing. I'm adding a lemon zest and a couple of strawberries. Now let's add a little extra flair. Ta-da! I'm done! Wow! Oh, it's like a cloud. Magic. It is not so important. The main thing is the taste. And I'm sure my mm. ice cream will be the most delicious. Because I always make it with love. That's it. Done. Love, beauty. That's all nonsense. The sweeter, the more delicious. That's what I think. That's why we need to decorate the ice cream with candy and cookies. Yay! Aurea skittles are awesome. And top it off with chocolate tapping. Aren't you overdoing it, grandson? Just right. Let's see. Oh my. Wow, what's that? It looks fascinating, but does it taste good? What? Is that peppermint? Well, I'll take it out. No lack of mint won't say this ice cream. Um, no, no, no. No. 
Shall I try this one? Hmm. It looks interesting. Uh, it's not bad, yeah. but it's not great. Oh, how about this one? Oh, this is the one. Sweet and delicious. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I can spin without okay. stopping. Hey, get together. Okay. I want the most delicious cake. Wow. Cool. I'll make the coolest one. Nice. Anything. Easy. I'm a professional. Yes. What all kind of right, cake without right, delicious right. cream? Carefully put another cake, another layer of cream, and another cake, and another, and another. Hmm. Let's see. I'll do something interesting. Great. A heart cake with for my beloved Margot. I'll decorate it a little. Let's take a Kit Kat and some cream. Hmm. It turned out well. Perfect. And I'll add some chocolates on top. Margot will like it. Now I'll show you how a cake should look like. Cut it in half. Put one half on the other. Cut out the middle. And then turn it over. Now I'm going to use the colored cream. It will make the cake look even more like a rainbow. I will align the cream a little and make beautiful fluffy yes! clouds next. Perfect. I'll add cute eyes and a mouth. This is how a real masterpiece looks like. You have no chance. <laughs> it is not necessary that the cake is beautiful. The main thing is that it's delicious. Ah, perfect. What? This mound doesn't even look like a cake. I'm not done yet. Now my cake will also become bright. Milk colored chocolate. Aha. Uh -huh. Let's then add some sparkles. And some more, cause girls love sparkles. Wow, that's so cool. Perfect. My cake will definitely win. Wow, it's not a bad idea, but my cake okay. is still better. Wow, what a beautiful bright cake. Perhaps I'll start with it. Awesome. Mm, how delicious. I'll try grandma's cake next. Mm. Mm, my favorite sweets and chocolate. Perfect. Yes. Um, what kind of weird cake is this? We'll try it. Uh, it doesn't taste good. No. So the cake from the chef has won. I told you I'd win. And you fix okay. your cap. Let's see who makes the best chocolate with marshmallows. Ooh. Perfect. Okay. Easy as pie. Yes. I'll do it. Well, why are we sitting? We need to start cooking. My secret to delicious hot chocolate is that I add Margot's favorite chocolate to it. I'll mix it well. Yes! Add some Hershey's. Incredible. Let's mix it again and... I'm going to pour it into the mug that Margot gave me. Look what a beauty with my portrait. Oh my! Big deal. A mug. You don't understand. Now I'll try how I did it. Mm, delicious. Um, okay, as you wish. Okay. Real hot chocolate should be drunk from such glasses, not from mugs. I'll pour hot chocolate now. Okay, you need to whisk the cream and make a beautiful fluffy hat and decorate it with marshmallows. This is how hot chocolate should look like. <laughs> Don't touch it with your hands. Um, what should I do? <gasps> a can of cream. I'll need it. How delicious. We need to make a bigger hat and more marshmallows. Ah, perfect. And also add some candy. Maybe some Oreos. All right, all right, and chocolate all right. sauce. Ah, some cookie sticks. No one has done this for sure. Okay. Well, I'll try hot chocolate first from this participant. How many marshmallows? It's so good. It's impossible to stop. Oh, I gave this mug to grandma. <laughs> Although her hot chocolate is so-so. I need a straw for this glass. Mmm, delicious.
delicious! Wow. We need to think a little. Nice. And Andy wins! Hooray! Oh. I'm a real master! Oh, I'm juggling. This time I want some yes. chips. Wow. How to cook them? Okay. Only know how to eat them. Oh, time without your professional Let's tricks. Go. I'll keep an eye on you. Duh. Um, what should I do? Okay. It's simple. Look. We take the potatoes. We peel them like this. Then cut them like this. Turn on the stove, pour oil, and put the potatoes in. Well, that's pretty much it. Hmm. Uh, I see. Ah. Well, hold on, potato. Ha! Now, let's add more oil. There's no time to wait. I'll turn on the stove immediately to the maximum. The lid will be useful for protection. Throwing potatoes, take care. Oops. Um, it seems like it was a bad idea. Be careful, Andy. Oh, I think it turned out perfectly. Oh my. Ordinary chips. <laughs> my chips will be really excellent. Let's take the tortillas. Cut them carefully. Now I'm going to take some oil. You still won't be able to repeat after a professional. Hit the oil and fry the sliced tortillas until golden brown. And now, what kind of nachos without cheese? I'm gonna put some nachos on the plate and then melt the cheese. This already looks so good. We'll pour the sauce over our nachos. Decorate with lime slices and you're done. This is an excellent dish. I won't be so happy that early. Hey! Oh, I completely forgot about them! Oh, they should be put on a plate. Hope Margot likes that. I don't think so. What should I do? Um, let's mm. add some cheese powder. It'll fix everything. Nice. Mmm. Yeah, doesn't seem to help. Okay, let's hope Marco likes it. Oh my! My chips are ready. A little salt, and it will turn out super good. Great! Well, and what kind of embers are these? Okay, I'll try a piece. Oh, what a horror! It's impossible to eat. And these look delicious. Mm, how yummy! Wait, are these chips all right, for sure? All right, all right. I'll take a bite. No, no, it's strange. So, Grandma's chips win. Yes. I told you! You've heard it! What? Oh, head chip will come in handy. Yes. I want some spaghetti. Okay, no problem. Right. For sure, okay. dear. If only I knew how to cook it. Well, what do I do with that? Okay, put them in a saucepan. Wait, why don't they fit? How do you cook them? Oh, come on, get in! Uh, wait. Not stupid spaghetti, I'll show you now. Uh, come on, get in! What are you doing? First, you need to turn on the stove. See? And then put the spaghetti in the water. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> See? That's easy. Holy They're holy. melting in. Okay. What's the matter? Yeah, you definitely don't have a chance. Hmm. Real pasta is prepared differently. We take the flour. Yes! Pour it out with a slide. Make a recess in the center. Then take the eggs. We carefully break and knead the dough. A little black dye and you'll already get an unusual pasta. It is necessary to cover the dough for a while. I'll make time for it. Let's see. Okay. What? Oh, this what? is a mess. You guys, you all can right, take out the dough right, now perfectly. Right. <laughs> now we're gonna roll it out. Just like so. And now cut it. It turns out like real Italian pasta. Now we're going to boil it. Carefully put it on a plate. 
Perhaps the octopus is perfect for this pasta. Let's fry it. Put it on top of the pasta and you're done. Awesome! What are you doing? Why so much ketchup? There's no such thing as too much ketchup. Oh. Uh, wait, what's that? Andy, what are you doing? The spaghetti don't want to come out! Huh? Okay, never mind. I'll get you now. Ugh, it doesn't seem to help me anymore. Oh, no! My opinion, spaghetti should not look like this. Why are they so difficult to cook? Wait, what if I replace them with ready made noodles? I can definitely hand it here. Everything. Okay, we're pouring it out. Cover it. And wait a little. Ready made noodles. Aw, oh, what a horror. These noodles are ready. Cool. Octopus, really? That looks disgusting. Uh, how to eat it? Mm, it's rubbery. What? I can't even take a bite of it. Disgusting. Spaghetti with ketchup looks delicious. Let's try it. Mm, it's so good. Mm. We eat noodles in a box. Interesting. Mm, it seems not bad, but I'm very spicy. My mouth is burning. Funny. I look like a dragon. So Andy wins. It's a joke, right? Ah, oh, you scared me. What do you want me to cook? Waffles! Wonderful choice, the chef approves. It's easy. Yeah. Oh, cool, I'll start with the eggs. See how I can do it. Careful, you break it all. That's what I want, Grandma, and no all sugar. All right, all right, all right. Quite a little bit. I got it, one pinch. Well done. <laughs> Did you believe it? The more sugar, the tastier. And here is the flour. Oh, I think I'm going to sneeze. Oh, it's gone. Hey, God. <laughs> Oops. Come on, grandson. You've got the whole table dirty. It was an accident. Come on. Great, there's flour. Now I need milk. It won't be difficult. Activating super speed. I'm faster than any mixer. Surprise. Skittles will definitely cheer up the baby. Beauty. The bowls are ready, as is the dough. We just need to connect them. Be patient a little more, baby, and the waffles are going to be amazing. Whoa, it's great that I have a heart shaped waffle iron. You can pour multicolored dough, and rainbow waffles will turn out. One moment. Hooray! It's just a bomb. Yummy. To surprise the baby, I will decorate them with chocolate sprinkles. Whoa, I would have eaten them myself and not for a challenge. What a beauty, then all the teeth will be green. I spoil the stomach and taste of waffles, so I won't add them. The kid will try my version and will not be able to stop. Grandma's secret is maple syrup and, of course, butter. These waffles are incomparable. What about natural dyes? Zucchini will make my waffles both delicious and beautiful at once. Two in one, and the chef has a victory in her pocket. <laughs> it remains only to add a couple of irreplaceable ingredients and you can pour the dough into the waffle iron. Let's go! Ah, <laughs> oh, voila. The chef presents oh, to your yeah. attention gorgeous waffles. Now it's time for the decor. And a couple of leaves what? for the fat. Leaves, it's disgusting. <laughs> Come on, baby. How interesting. Whoa, you've all tried really hard. I'll start with the waffles from the grandma. Ooh, a piece of butter. Okay. It's delicious, but too simple. Whoa, what an unusual decor. What are the leaves doing here? Well, no way. The waffles themselves look kind of good. Let's try them now. Aw, oh, what a mess. It tastes like a washcloth. I won't do that. Whoa, what a cool waffle. They're also in the shape of hearts. How cute. Thank you, brother. It's delicious and very tasty. I'm full. 
Ah! Awesome. And you won! Yeah. Thank you! Hooray! <laughs> what did you draw this time? You'll see now! <laughs> Cook me some french fries! Easily. Okay. It will be done. Hey, Grandma, you've already started. I didn't sleep. Oh, hmm. I see. Is it oil? Super. Where is always poured there? Right, into the frying pan. Come on, I need more. Uh, yeah, that's much better. Uh, now I need the package of french fries. Well, for the baby, anything, right? Oh, no, wait. There's too much oil in there. Oh, uh, where the splashes come from? Oh, people, stop, stop, stop! Oh, cooks like that. Sorry, Grandma. Oil should be added much less than you think. Watch and learn, honey. That's enough. Now you can turn on the stove and put potatoes in some small portions. Although you're right, it's faster this way. The main thing is that the oil does not splash. Delicious and crispy potatoes are ready. Oh, yes. You can put it in a bowl and add some juicy ketchup. What do you say, chef? <laughs> Bravo, Grandma. Although the design is weak, in the challenge you need to show imagination. I'll divide the potatoes into portions and take the thinnest slices of bacon. Fry it a little and wrap the potatoes there. Voila! So much better. And you're right about the sauce. It'll make the dish so much better and parsley will give it a charm. Brilliant! Ah, oh, perfect. Hmm. I don't know how to cook potatoes. What should I do? Oh, I've got it. Now the baby will be shocked. After all, I will treat her with my mm, favorite marmalades. They look so much like french fries. Bon appetit, little sister. Since everyone is dropping more sauce, I'll do it too. And I'll pour strawberry syrup instead. Help yourselves. <laughs> Hooray! French fries look great. And how delicious it smells. Let's see what grandma has prepared. <laughs> how cool. Mm. Oh, so tasty. And what kind of masterpiece is this from Chef? Mmm, I don't eat parsley, but the sauce is very appetizing. Mmm, yummy. It's worth a try. Oh, I don't like bacon. Ew. Oh. I wonder what my brother did. Whoa. It's marmalade. I want more. It's awesome. I give the victory to my brother again. Yay. Awesome. Thank you, baby. 2-0. It's much better this way. <laughs> Thank you, Grandma. And now I want some rolls. I understand you. <laughs> You've come to the right place. <gasps> Goodies, what kind of rolls? <laughs> Nori and fish don't work. <laughs> Once the kid gets high with marmalades, I use them again. It's so delicious. First you need to pour cream and then put marmalade eyes and of course, add some marmalade oh, bears. <laughs> Oh, I've got a tug guy. Huh, so cool. The only thing wow. left is to pour it with syrup. Watch how the master cooks. Mmm, yummy. Wow. <laughs> Marmalade alone does not satisfy <laughs> hunger. Moreover, the baby has already eaten them. If she asks for rolls, then she wants rolls. To begin with, I will pour some rice. Rice. <laughs> so that's what you need for the rolls. Granny knows how to cook that. Ah, oh uh, oh. don't look here. The second ingredient is avocado. Maximum of healthy fats, minimum of hardly carbohydrates. Grandma can do that too. Oh, this grandma already. She definitely won't be able to slice salmon as thinly as a pro. Rice is already cooked. Oh yeah, I completely forgot about nori. Cheese and avocado will be the filling, and that will help me give the rolls the right shape. Wonderful. The only thing left is to put fish on top. The dish from the chef is served. Wow. Wow. Oh. I'm not too far from the chef, right? Oh. What to do? Oh. I've got an idea. If you need a round shape, you can take a cucumber. Cut out a piece from the filling and put cheese inside. Ah, oh, there will be granny-style rolls. We are ready, baby. <laughs> Let's see, it doesn't look like rolls, but I tried anyway. 
Duh. Ah, I don't like it. Sorry, Grandma. I don't eat that. And the rolls Ew. from the shelf look exactly no. as oh. I drew. Look at them. Whoa, how delicious. Mmm, so mm, good. Yummy. What is this? Ah, it's spicy wasabi. Save me. <laughs> Ooh, what a beauty. <laughs> this is delicious. Nice. Ah, gorgeous, mm. bro. You're the best. Hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> Finally, I want some coffee. I'll do it in two seconds. Okay, honey. Grandma is a pro. Okay. Agreed. I've had this bag for a very long time. It's finally time to use it and brew a cup of fragrant instant coffee. You just need to pour boiling water over it and add some milk. Let's see. Perfect. Hmm. Nice. Hey. Oh, ew. How bitter it is and hot. I bet baby likes cold and sweet. I'll take ice and add chocolate syrup. And at the same time, decorate the cup with it. Wow. Awesome. And now I use ready-made proven coffee from the pros. I know it will definitely be delicious. Wow. And I also love cream. If I like it, the baby will like it too. Woohoo! Ta-da! Cool. I'll sprinkle Oreo cookies on top. Tough guy. Wow! Cool. Look, Grandma. What are you listening to, grandson? Check it out, Grandma. Yo! What's the Actually, we have a challenge. What a fragrance. The chef uses only the best coffee beans. First, you need to grind them, and then you can brew them. Everything should be accurate. Only then will the perfect taste turn out, which means my victory. With the help of a flask, you can control the volume of milk. And at the same time, beat it right there. What kind of technology? What? It's simple, Grandma. You can also use gadgets to achieve this result. Another secret, cotton candy will make any coffee amazing. How do you like it? <sighs> Whoa, baby, try. <laughs> ah, cool. Let's start with Grandma's mug. <laughs> ah, disgusting. I can't drink this. No, 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 no. What? How so? Hmm. Wow, cotton candy, it's crazy. This is mega cool. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> How do you like my mustache? <laughs> and I've already forgotten about coffee. You should try it too. But not without cotton candy, of course. Mm, I really like it. Awesome. And what did my brother cook? Whoa, is that an Oreo? And even cream. What a yummy thing. Mmm, yummy. Cold coffee is cool. I knew it. Hooray! Glad you liked it. Hmm. Who should I give the victory to? Well, Chef won. This is the most delicious coffee I've ever tried. <laughs> Grandma! Okay, guys. In the first round, I want you to prepare a Coca-Cola jelly for me. That's easy. Gotcha! A jelly? Oh, I've never done this. And I really even have an idea where to start. First, of course, you need to take a Coke. Let's do this. Uh, almost perfect. Except for a couple of drops. Oh, chill, you better try off. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. First of all, I need to free up the Coke bottle a little. I'll do it in the most pleasant way. And now, the signature burn. <laughs> And you were saying something about manners! Okay, you need to add a little candy to the cola. It'll be tastier and more beautiful with it. Next, I'll pour corn syrup into the same bottle. And it's thanks to it that my cola will soon turn into jelly. It remains only to shake it thoroughly. Oh, it seems the corn syrup was too sticky. Yeah, let's move on. Wait, yeah. It's definitely too sticky. We'll have to tear it out by force! Otherwise, how will Vicky taste my masterpiece? Oh, come on! 
Oh. Whew. It worked. Oh well. My jelly is almost ready. It remains only to cool it a little so that it is even more jelly-like and delicious to taste. Awesome. Oh, everything is too complicated. The best jelly is ordinary honey, which you can just put in ice. Isn't that a brilliant idea? Yeah, complete nonsense. I'll show you how to make real jelly. To begin with, pour the cola into the pan. After that, I'll throw some cold marmalades into this cola. They will melt and make my future masterpiece even better. The last ingredient is secret. I'll give the jelly a brilliant glow. Now, the resulting mixture should be cooked in a frying pan, stirring it thoroughly. And when the jelly's ready, you can pour it into a bottle. Just like so. Filling it up. And the last step is cooling the jelly. Okay. No one can handle this as well as liquid nitrogen. We need to fill the bottle. Then wait a few seconds. Children, be careful. Do not do this without adults. Ready. Vicky, it's time to choose today's winner. I don't even know where to start. Everything looks very appetizing. Perhaps let the grandmother be the first. Um, tastes like ordinary honey. <laughs> now it's chef's turn. It looks beautiful, of course, but why is it so shiny? Well, Jill is the one left. Wow, very tasty. I think no one has a question. Jill becomes the winner. Yeah, I knew that. <laughs> oh, what is this? This is everything you need to make waffles. Let's go, guys. It'll be done. Uh, waffles? But what? Oh, waffles are my signature dish. And I know better than anyone what kind of waffles my granddaughter prefers. First, you need to knead the dough. Everything is standard here. Flour, eggs, butter. And oh, we're without sugar and milk. Milk, by the way, is unrealistically good. The dough is almost ready. How do you like this speech, huh? Um, not impressive. My machine does it faster. Oh, oh how so? Oh, 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 faster! Oh, faster! Oh, Jill, I'm sorry. Yeah, with two hands, it's way faster. Yeah, I doubt that. Here, I have everything ready. It remains only to divide the dough into small parts. And now, putting them in separate bowls. It's colorful. Now we can cook our waffles. With the help of colored dough, I'll be able to make colored waffles. And I also have it very tasty. I've already tried everything myself. Yum! Oh well. Do you think you can compete with the great chef Annie? As if not so. My rainbow waffle is ready. Now you need to present it beautifully. Why not do it on a black plate? And some whipped cream will play the role of clouds. And a little bit of color sprinkles will not hurt. For extra beauty. Awesome. Right on top. Oh, I know that my granddaughter loves my grandmother's waffles the most. And they're already done. Decorating them with ice cream and berries. There is nothing better on such a sunny summer day. And a little maple syrup wouldn't hurt either. Yeah. That's weird. <laughs> Calm down. I have everything under control. Oh, man. Or not. Oh, I have an idea. I'll definitely have something useful there, but not that. Oh, big ears! I didn't know you had time to get into my backpack. 
Oh, and here's what I need. Noodles! It is from the instant noodles that I'll make a new waffle. Putting it in… Look! It turned out very appetizing. Oh, I don't think so. And let's ask Vicky. Well, well. What kind of noodle waffle is this? Never seen this before. I hope this is also good. Let's check it out. <laughs> Ugh, disgusting! I've never tried anything worse in my life! But grandma made waffles like I love. It's nice to know how some people care about you. Thanks, grandma. It's unrealistically delicious. Oh, yeah. Cool. Wow. And Chef Annie made a real work of art. Besides, it's very tasty. Bravo. But perhaps this time no one can compare with Granny's waffles. I love them since I was a child. She is the winner. Oh, hooray! I knew I could beat everyone! What is it this time? I want donuts. I hope you'll please me with them. I'll make donuts quickly. Hey, delicious. Oh. Oh, never mind. Delicious? I agree. <laughs> Natalie's so good. Uh, uh, have we already started? Uh, sorry. I was completely distracted. But okay, I'm ready to start cooking. First, I need to take a pack of Oreos and crush the cookies. Ta-da! Now this crumb needs to be mixed with Nutella. My favorite part of cooking. Because after that, you can try what I've got. Oh yeah, yummy! It remains only to pour the resulting chocolate mixture into this machine for making donuts. Just look at that. Oh, where is it? Oh, here's the donut mix. Thank you, chef. I'll pour it in the form of the mold. And let's wait. Ah, uh, how slow you are. Here are my mini donuts already. Look how lovely it is. Now they need to be divided in half. Just like so. Gotcha. And then I'll put some syrup inside. Almost done. Now I need liquid marshmallow. Which I'll decorate my donuts with right on top. To do this, I'll put it in a bag and squeeze it on the donuts through the hole on the other side. So convenient and very tasty. And the last step remains. Sprinkles. Without it, donuts are not donuts. Just look at how quickly I cooked it. Masterpiece. You can only envy. Oh, I so. My donuts are almost ready. I just have to sprinkle them with powdered sugar. Oh, oh chill. Oh, I'm sorry. Now everything is ready. I really want to try these donuts, but I'm holding on. Oh, they're for Vicky. <laughs> and for her sister, Jill. Oh, what a mess. No need to wave a dangerous device like that. Yeah! Look how lovely it is. And these donuts will be even tastier after I additionally smear them with Nutella. Vicky, it's time to choose who wins this time. Chef Annie has the most beautiful donuts. I want to try them first. Mm, they're not just beautiful, but also incredibly delicious. I'm absolutely delighted. Next, let's try Grandma's Donuts. Oh, delicious! But, too usual. I was waiting for something more. Jill, I hope your donuts will surprise me. Chocolate like I love. But, Chef Annie still has the most delicious donuts. Let's congratulate her on her victory! And now she's asking for a pile of pancakes. No question. Hey. Grandma, wake up! We need to make pancakes! Oh. oh, um, I know how to do that. Grandma and Chef needed the dough so quickly that no one even noticed it. 
And now they're fine pancakes. It looks delicious, but I can do better. I'll add some food coloring to the dough. There'll be different colors. Wow, Handy decided to place the baby with something unusual. Look what a bright colored dough he has. It'll be very tasty and beautiful. Oh. oh. You're so sloppy, Andy. And in general, pancakes are best with some maple syrup and a piece of butter. What? This is a simple, proven over the years recipe. Pancakes with maple syrup? This will not surprise anyone. Here's a serving of pancakes from a professional. I'll need an egg for that. This recipe is called poached egg. It is necessary to boil water in a saucepan and break the egg directly into the water. And while it's cooking, I'll take slices of ham and leaves of greens. And I'll put it all beautifully between the pancakes. Awesome. <laughs> it's time for the baby to appreciate the efforts of the participants of the challenge. First from Andy. Mm. They're simply delicious, especially in combination with marshmallows. And now let's try pancakes from Grandma. Uh, they look pretty yeah. simple, however very tasty. And pancakes from the chef look unusual, but the raw yolk of a poached egg is disgusting. Mm. The baby did not appreciate it. And the victory goes to Andy. Yeah, I won! Let me fix it for you. Hey. Don't touch it, Grandma! Attention, everyone! The baby wants a juicy steak. No question. Grandma can do it. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. I'll be fine. That's it. We take it and fry it. Nothing complicated. How can you fry without oil? You need to lubricate the grill pan thoroughly. Yeah, I'm going to add oil too! Duh. Oh, Andy, don't add so much oil. And of course, you should try to get oil in the pan. Now we throw a piece of meat into a frying pan and fry it. <gasps> wow! <laughs> Impressed? Come on. Absolutely! Oh, uh, I can do it too! <laughs> of course, Andy, the main thing is not to miss the frying pan. Oh, uh, I didn't miss! <sighs> Oh, young man, watch and learn. By the way, my steak is almost ready. Now you can also add some salt. <laughs> cool throw. Big deal. Hey. Grandma, look, I'm going to give you a lift now. Are you look, ready? I'm like a real chef. No. Oh, no. It fell on the floor. <laughs> yes. And it collected hair and dirt. And it's also raw and undercooked. <laughs> uh... Uh, maybe she won't notice. Oh my god. Oh, you can't serve a dish like that. I don't know what to do. I'll pour more ketchup. It'll hide all the flaws. That's it. Mm, it smells great. Oh, thank you, Mia. My steak is really beautiful. It remains to add springs and rosemary as a decoration. And that's all your decoration, Grandma? I know something better. Mia knows the secret of the famous golden steak. It'll be a real golden steak like in the most expensive restaurant. Meat should be cut with a sharp oh. knife so as not to spoil the appearance of the steak. Awesome. Oh, that's how it is. I didn't know it. Ready? Now you can serve it. <laughs> Finally, you can try the dishes. Meat with ketchup does not cause the baby's appetite. Um, just look at it. You can see the hair endured. Oh my. And the golden steak. I wonder if the baby will taste it. Hmm. hmm. It seems delicious, but not impressive. Grandma's steak smells delicious, and most of all, it came to the baby's liking. Simple and no frills, but what a taste! Grandma's steak undoubtedly takes the first place. I won! Hooray! It's time to eat dessert, and the baby wants to eat ice cream. Oh, I know the recipe's fried ice cream. Oh, grandma can make ice cream? Okay. Nothing complicated. Oh. So what is in the recipe? You need to chop it into small pieces. Okay. Hmm. Oh, beautiful. Now I'm going to chop it into pieces too. <laughs> Easy as pie. I like chopping ice cream. Oh, watch your knives, young man. And don't throw food around the kitchen. Ugh, got carried away. Sorry, Grandma. <laughs> That's what happens when amateurs get to work. Meanwhile, I have already prepared everything. 
It remains to complete the dish with a beautiful serving. Nice. Oh, everything turned out perfectly. I'll decorate the ice cream with lemon zest. The sour taste of lemon is perfectly combined with the sweetness of ice cream. Some mint leaves and some smoke of dry ice. This is how ice cream is served in the most refined restaurants. Awesome. Just look at this. Incredible. <laughs> wow. Grandma also prepared everything. Cut and twist. Um, uh, it's not really working out. The ice cream's stuck. Okay, let's just put some chocolate syrup on top. No. <laughs> That's funny. I'm almost done too. Nothing complicated. <laughs> now I'll put in a bowl and decorate it with whipped cream. I love it. I'll have much more for the baby. And now I'll sprinkle some Rainbow Skittles candies, a sugar straw for beauty, and some Oreo cookies. Please. Grandma, will you let me? Okay. Oh, thank you. Now I'm going to pour oh chocolate God. syrup. Oh, yeah. so much sugar. Oh, yeah. Let's see what the baby thinks. <laughs> the colored ice cream from my brother looks incredibly beautiful. But the gorgeous presentation from the chef struck the baby more. Time to try it. A oh, lemon says it's too sour. Oh. Ice cream slices and chocolate mm. syrup looks unappetizing, but it tastes nothing unusual. Finally, it's time to try the ice cream from the brother. Whipped cream, sugar straws, and Skittles. Incredibly delicious combination. Mm. Awesome. And the winner is… Brother. Oh. Yeah! I knew it! Grandma, let me hug you! <laughs> Everyone concentrate, oh. we continue our culinary duel. The next request is a croissant. The French really like to eat croissants with coffee for breakfast. Oh, grandma, are you from France? Do you know how to cook croissants? Grandma knows everything. They can be put in the oven and let's wait for it to cook. Ah, I can do that too! One second and let's bake! Hmm, well done, yeah. grandson. I don't approve of frozen dough. Cooking it yourself is not so difficult. By the way, our chef Mia has worked in the best restaurants in Paris and knows the oldest recipe for croissants. According to the recipe, dishes were prepared for Louis himself, the king of France. Therefore, the baby is waiting for a truly royal dessert. And the brother and grandmother watch the chef actions in amazement. How devilish she kneaded the dough, laid it out in layers, and twisted it. What a skill! It remains only to put it in the oven and wait. I won't be able to cook so cool, but I'll add Nutella to my croissants. Oh, my favorite chocolate nut paste. Mmm, delicious. Oh, what kind of manners. It's time to get their croissants. Mmm, how wonderful and rosy. Andy? Look! You're on fire! Oh no! Not that! The brother got carried away with Nutella and his croissants burned down. Yes, the chocolate paste is really very tasty. Don't worry, you're doing great. Yeah, croissants are baked. It's time to start serving. I need incision and you can pour out prepared cream. I'll add strawberries and I'll decorate the dish with powdered sugar on top. Voila! Everything is ready. Now we can try it. Burn croissants from the brother look terrible. Yeah, it's not worth trying them. Oh, what a smell! Croissants from grandma are delicious, sweet, and so nice. Our baby really liked it. Wow, strawberry sweet cream and delicious dough made according to the royal recipe. Mm, Without a doubt, yummy. croissants from the chef take the first place. Mm. Let's start with a simple one. Cook me some french fries. Easy. It will be done. I just want to learn how to cook. While everyone is spilling potatoes, I better hit the butter. By the way, there is never much of it. Well, the butter is almost boiling, which means that it's time to pour out the ready-made slices of french fries. No! Stop! Oh, it's splashing! Cut! Help! What are you doing? Because of you, we were almost bombarded by boiling oil. The oil should be poured carefully. Then fry the potatoes evenly. <laughs> Cut them, nothing difficult. Okay. The french fries are ready. There's only a little sauce left to add. 
fries? In my opinion, this is an ordinary fried potato, and I'll make real French fries. But that's not all. Now I'm going to make a real delicacy out of ordinary potatoes. I'll need bacon, some sauce, and of course, sweet rosemary. Mm, smells so good. Uh -oh. oh, I haven't lost everything yet. Why not use marmalade potato? They say if you dip it in strawberry syrup, it'll be even better. Mm. Okay. Well, I'll start trying with potatoes in the middle. Mm. Grandma, this is very nice. Oh, ew! I can't stand rosemary. Phew. I'm sorry, Madame Chef, but I didn't like it. But I appreciate the idea of marmalade potatoes. Brother, you're doing great. Now I don't know who to choose. Let it be grandmother. Hooray! This time, this task is more difficult. You need to cook sushi. Come on! It'll be done. According to the best recipe. What? Sushi? Sushi? Yeah, I have no idea what sushi is in the countryside. What is that? I'm going to make sushi that you never dreamed of. What? Ordinary sushi is boring. Another thing is sushi made out of different candies. Instead of cream cheese, there will be delicious whipped cream inside. And of course, gummies. Oh, perfect. We must not forget about the chocolate syrup. <laughs> An interesting idea. I will also have sushi ready very soon. The main thing is to repeat very carefully after the chef. Nothing complicated yet. Nothing complicated. So let's see what disgusting sushi you have. <sighs> I can add sauce, too. You don't have to be super smart for that. What is that? Avocado? The most important thing is to twist everything perfectly, which you, Grandma, certainly won't succeed at. Ta-da! The perfect sushi is almost ready. What a horror! I didn't think your sushi was so ugly! It's time to wrap sushi in salmon. The main thing is to add a lot of fish cut into chunky pieces. And we must not forget about soy sauce. Hmm. Fish, you say? Okay. It will be done. Perfect. I hope it turned out delicious. Whoa! Oh no! The chef's sushi look more attractive. What? Bingo! I can't put this whore in front of my granddaughter, but I have an idea. Why not make cucumber sushi? It's both delicious and healthy. Oh, really? And disgusting. Why is that? Cucumber is an ideal ingredient for sushi. You just need to put more rice into it. It doesn't look good. Wait a little, I'm not done. Adam, look what a beauty. What is this? What? I've never seen cucumber and rice sushi. They don't even have fish. I'm not tasting it. But I will try sweet sushi okay. with pleasure. Hooray! Mm, delicious, but it's not satisfying at all. The last candidate is left. Wow. Here they are, real sushi. Mm. Mm, so good, Madame Chef, you have one. Thank you, but it was obvious. Oh no! I hope each of you can make a waffle. I heard that you need to start with dough. I think I won't have any problems with it. Okay. We'll add some sugar. Yeah! Mix it up a little. 
Perfect. It's time to add flour. Oh, I think I got something in my nose. Wow. Here's a waffle. It's okay. This flour is enough for me to make delicious waffle. You just need to stir everything well. Let's do it. Okay, so now my finished dough can be poured into a waffle iron. These will be the most delicious waffles in my sister's life. Mmm, the dough turned out very tasty, and most importantly, without eggshells. I hope it will make a decent waffle. Everyone added sugar, but I know that sugar is harmful. So I'll add a whole ripe eggplant instead. And I'll make dough out of it. Let's do it. It will be absolutely perfect. Perfect. And now we'll add some eggs. And of course, some flour. Let's mix it up well. And add some greens for the taste. It even sounds disgusting. But this dough is much better than yours. Mm, what? And now you can pour it into a waffle iron. Just like that. And let's time it so we don't burn it. Yeah, timing is pretty good. Oh! It seems the waffle is a little burnt! No, no. Uh, hot! Hot! But that's okay. Thank I will hide its not very pleasant appearance with whipped cream, some berries, and chocolate syrup. Just like that. It's awesome! And I will traditionally pour maple syrup on my waffles. A piece of butter will also not be extra. Oh, wow. oh, it's so yummy. And I will decorate my already healthy waffles with healthy herbs. Hello! Let's try it! I'll start with this one. Oh, ew! Your waffle is kind of overcooked. I won't eat that. And this one? Ew! This waffle tastes like grass and eggplant! I hate it! Disgusting! And this one is pretty good! Oh yes! That's just what I wanted! Grandma, you're winning this round! Hooray! Finally, I want to drink a cup of delicious coffee! Wow! It'll be done! <laughs> Easy! I just came up with a brilliant idea. Hot coffee is boring. Today, cold coffee, which is frappuccino, is infection. You need to throw ice in a large jar. Then you need to add delicious chocolate syrup there. And of course, we must not forget about the coffee itself. I have it from Starbucks, by the way. And a cocktail of Twix chocolates will definitely not be extra. I'll blend it up a little and use it instead of milk. And I think I'll make a more classic coffee. I know that my granddaughter loves it. Ta-da! And this is the end. You need to add whipped cream and some chocolate sweets. Let's go! Yeah! Oreo cookies. Mmm, mm, so yummy. And a candy bar. Of course, we must not forget about the straw. Oh well, it's my turn to make coffee. With the help of a scale, I will measure the right amount of grains. Perfect. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now I will manually grind them to be the desired state. 
look and learn. And only now I will pour boiling water to the coffee. The coffee is actually made that way? Perfect. Now I will pour coffee into the cup. Mm, and I'll blend the milk on my own as well. Mm -hmm. You should also not forget about the appearance. Look what a beauty! Wow! <laughs> hmm. Um, I'll start with the middle one. Grandma, I'll always recognize this coffee, and it's time to admit that I don't like it at all. Oh. <laughs> okay. The first mug looks more pleasant. Delicious, but a little bitter for me. No. The last candidate left to win. Mmm, that's really cool. Brother, you win this round. Yeah! I decided that I want a birthday cake. Okay. Is everyone ready to make the best cake in the world? Yes. Zach, you're ready to eat everything, oh. right? It's better to make a cake not eating sweets. Come on. Okay. Okay. And I decided to cook the best chocolate cake for my granddaughter, Emma. I think Kit Kats will never be superfluous. Emma keeps asking me for them. A ribbon left? Ready. Chef, what do you think? Oh, some nonsense. Here, I will make the best cake in the world. The cream is so cool. We smear it. I put all the cakes on top of each other. Great. Now we cut the cake in half. And let's fold it. The only thing left is to make a rainbow out of it. Look. And don't forget about cute face. Ready. Nobody move. I have marshmallow tower. Oh. It fell. Well, it's already again. Yes! What delicious marmalade ribbon. I'm going to put it on my marshmallow cake. Let's add some more of my sister's favorite marmalade. And the final touch, marmalade hearts. Nice. Yay. My sister should know that I love her very much. Come on, try it. Ah, oh, so interesting. This one looks appetizing. Mmm, mm, so cool. Yes! I like it. There are even more clouds here. They're so sweet. Oh. Uh, a million likes. Is this a chocolate cake? We need to try it soon. <laughs> I love chocolate. And then there's my favorite Kit Kat. Mmm, cool. Here's the most favorite marmalades. Well, what a cutie. Ah, uh, and I love marshmallows too. So good. Well, I choose the cake from the chef as a winner. Congratulations, chef. Are we moving on? I want some chips. Will you cook it? Okay. Everyone is ready and we start mm. cooking. Mm, grandma, will you show me how to peel potatoes? No okay. problem, grandson. You take a vegetable peeler and clean it. It's simple. Next, you have to carefully cut the potato into rings and send it to the hot oil. Now fry it until crispy. Okay, so it's easy. <laughs> Well, I peeled the potatoes. Now we're slicing. I don't need a knife anymore, but I need oil. Okay, pour it on the frying pan. Great. Throw the potatoes. Oh no, the oil is attacking me. I won't give in to you so easily. Insidious oil. Granny, what are you doing? Everything is fine. Okay, now I'll show you the master class on chips. I don't like these potatoes, so I'm gonna need a tortilla. Cut the tortilla into triangles. I want to make not just chips, but nachos. They're much tastier, right? Now pour oil into the frying pan and put the nachos. Oh. We need a guacamole. Rice avocado. Knead with a fork. Spread the guacamole on the crispy nachos and add some tomatoes. Yes. Ready? The last step, some thyme. Yay. Oh, granny, are you all right? Oops, bless you. So where was I? That's right, pings of thyme and lemon. Ready. What does it smell like? My chips are on fire! What a horror! I can't see them because of the black smoke! Oh no, my chips, they're ruined! They look like embers, not chips! Let's serve them anyway. Maybe it'll do. And this you need to find out from the baby. Ah, hmm. uh, everything smells delicious, but not this. Ew, they're terrible! I don't want this. Mm, what is this? 
Whoa, a whole plate of chips. This amount is enough for cartoons. Very tasty. Mm, I can't get away. Oh. Whoa. And what is this? The chef has prepared a new culinary masterpiece. Hmm. You need to check it out, right? Mmm, it's too useful. No, disgusting. Granny will win. I want Coco. Will you do it for me? It's super duper simple, right? <laughs> of course we'll do it. Ah, uh, it's easy. We just need to pour some milk in a saucepan, pour oh. Coco, boil, and pour everything into a good mug. My face on it, of course. Okay, let's pour. A little more. Ha. Ah, perfect taste. Chef, do you want to try? Oh, that's fine. I'll cook it much better. I will not just have cocoa, but a whole foam of cocoa. I just need to melt chocolate, pour it into round shape, pour some marshmallows and cocoa inside. Mix it up. And now we put it in a glass and pour some milk. I'm gonna have the best cocoa ever. Oops, uh, sorry. Oh, well, now I'm all covered in milk. Okay, so where was I? Oh, pour some milk into a saucepan. Warm it up and have some blue dye. Great, the milk turned sky blue. And now the most interesting thing. We dip the glass in syrup and in colored sprinkles. It's much tastier this way. Blue cocoa into a mug, squeeze out the yellow cream. The only thing left is to decorate with marshmallows. Yes. That's oh ready. My. Once everything is ready for everyone, then we go to the tasting to the baby. I want to try it. Marshmallow with cream, so beautiful. And delicious. Cool. Thank you, brother. Oh. What's here? It's from my beloved granny. Hmm. Hmm. Not what I wanted at all. Oh. What's this? Ooh, I need to put chocolate bowl into hot milk. And what will happen? Whoa, it's completely melted. I must try. Mmm, delicious. Oh. But what to choose? One, two, three, this is what I'll get. Okay, Brother Coco wins. What? Really? Did I really win? Now make me some pasta. Okay. The chef is ready. <laughs> Granny too. And brother knows what to cook too. No. I don't know anything. I don't know how to cook pasta. Why do I need it so long? Oh, that's what I should do, Grandma. Thank you. It's simple now. Don't forget to stir with a spoon. Spaghetti are already cooked. Zach, if you really want to learn how to cook, then follow me. We cook spaghetti ourselves. It's simple. Flour, egg, and meat. Next, you need to paint the doll black. So you're not like everyone else. It's difficult to knead the doll. And now, we need to cut it in long pasta. Look. With the help of this bike. Oh, perfect. Now, we can put it in the boiling water. Next, we will cook octopus, because what kind of pasta without seafood? Octopus can be put directly on the pasta. Great. Grandma, what are you doing? What? Is something wrong? I make pasta with ketchup. It's delicious. Ah, uh, what's going on, Zach? Oh, Grandma, calm down. I have noodles stuck to the bottom. Okay, forget about it. I'm gonna make instant pasta. Noodles, right? Easy. Ready. Wow, so cool! Is this an octopus? What a horror! It's tasteless, disgusting! And this is something more appetizing! Ooh, that's already delicious! Mmm, I love it! And this is something interesting! Ooh, delicious! But very spicy! Uh, my mouth is burning. I choose pasta from my brother. Wow, where are we? Wow, what do we have here? It's a bomb! Get down, it's gonna explode. Hey. It looks broken. Something's wrong. Oh, I get it. It's a sweet bomb. Wow, so delicious. Truly an explosive taste. Wow. It's impossible to stop. I want to take a bite again and again. 
awesome. I wish I could try it too. Woo! No way, it's all mine. Did you finish eating it so quickly? Just the last piece remains. This is my first time eating a stopwatch. It's very tasty. What's that sound? It's coming from here. What is it? Ah! It's a real bomb, isn't it? Oh no, the real thing! Help! What's happening? Wow, look! Godspeed! Okay. Hello, everyone. I heard someone was asking for help. Don't worry, I'll save you. I have special tape. That's it, you're safe now. What's this? I wonder how soon it'll explode. It's not clear, but we need to hurry. Come on, I'll try to eat you or break you. Does anyone know what these buttons do? Well, I seem to have ruined everything. Oops. My work here is finished. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Whoa, so high. <gasps> Mary, what do we do with the bomb? Don't panic, I have a plan. What's the matter with you? Mary, this isn't gonna help. Okay, and this chicken? Of course not. How about this one? No! How boring you are. Oh, I found it. This should definitely work. Yeah. I'll cut the wire with these. That's a great idea. Okay. Wow, there's so many wires. Which one should I cut? No, 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 I think blue. Well, are we saved? Yeah, I saved us. Yes. Oh no, the time went even faster. No. Ah! Ouch. Wow, I'm covered in chocolate. Cool. Yeah, me too. Which one of us will eat the most chocolate? I'll win. One and one more. I won't let you do that. It's a draw. That was awesome. Open it. Wow, I'm so happy. This is a new iPhone. Wow, me too. This is the best gift. We have two identical iPhones. I don't know. Then I'll check it out. Wow, it feels so comfortable in my hand. And there's so many applications. But why would it work? There's something not right here. This is a chocolate iPhone. Wow. Yummy. Wow, you have a chocolate iPhone. And I have the real one. Super. Time to take a couple selfies. Yeah, great idea. Smile. Go away, you're ruining the frame. No. That's much better. Well, hold on. My revenge will be cruel. I'm so cute. <gasps> ah, help! Oh no, my iPhone! Serves you right. You scared me. Sorry. Where's my chocolate iPhone? Hope everything will be fine. Oh no, my new iPhone. Why? I won't be able to take selfies anymore. I have an idea. Mary! What do you want? Let's switch phones. Wow. Sure. Give me yours and I'll take mine. No, what's wrong with it? It's broken. Chelsea, you tricked me. What? She's also eating my chocolate iPhone. Give it back. I didn't sign up for this. Oh, there's only one small piece left. Wow. A chocolate charger. I doubt it'll help, but I can try. Okay. Wow. Now I can eat this iPhone endlessly. Wow, Mary was lucky. Sit there and envy me. So yummy. Maybe I can also do that with my iPhone. It's worth a try. I like your new hairstyle. <laughs> I'm first. Wow! Wow, a kinder surprise. And so many of them. Cool, me too. Wow. I got six. What, you too? How can we have chocolate and have real ones? I don't know. I'll start. Hooray, I'm lucky. I definitely got real ones. Oh, milk chocolate, I love it. Wow, and there's M&M's inside. This is twice as delicious. Wow, I want that too. Oh, that's right, I have my own Kinder Surprise. It smells so sweet. Oh, I have 
have a real egg. How disgusting. Serves you right. That's not fair. I hope the next one will be an egg too. I'm scared to try. Oh no. Oh, there's a yolk. Oh, I hate it. Ugh, that looks awful. This is the worst round ever. Well, I like it. After all, Kinder Surprise is the most yummy food in the world. It's sweet chocolate, and there's always a surprise waiting for you inside. Awesome! Wow, little chocolate balls! Oh, I love it! But I also want to eat a real Kinder Surprise. Chelsea, give me a taste, please. No! I can't just give this Kinder Surprise to anyone. It's only mine. You're so greedy. What should I do? I came up with it. I'll play a prank on Chelsea. Maybe then she'll understand that she needs to share with her friends. Which one should be next? Just what I needed. Yes! Stop! What a disgusting taste! What? You don't like it? You set me up. Hold on. I got it. Oh, oh no! My face! Your prank wasn't so successful. Oh, what a mess. You need to eat all those Kinder Surprises. No, not again. Ugh. Well, if I gotta, I gotta. Although I have a better idea. Let's take a minute for cooking. What are you up to again? Take one egg. Oops. We can take an egg and break it in a frying pan. We'll do that with all the eggs. And then we'll get rid of the eggshells. Scrambled eggs. Wow, that looks delicious. Mary, can I try it? No, these scrambled eggs are just for me. Oh, well, fine. This is a dangerous trick. Wow, so high. I have an idea. Got it. No! I think that suits you better. My scrambled eggs are ruined. <laughs> I don't want to cook anymore. I'm starting. Wow, a McDonald's meal. Super. Me too. Wow. I want to try it. Coca-Cola perfectly quenches any thirst. Hmm. What? How did that happen? What? Oh, I get it. It's a chocolate Coca-Cola. That's it. I love chocolate. Awesome. Wow, cool. Um, nom, nom, nom. Wow. And there's M&M candies. Wow, chocolate Coca-Cola with M&Ms is the perfect combination. I want it that way too. I'm soaking wet. No! Uh -huh. How do you like that Coke shower? There's nothing funny about it. Oops. Oops. What a pity. You're out of Coca-Cola. I wonder if my french fries are chocolate too. Yes! Total delight. <laughs> chocolate french fries. <gasps> no one else has ever tried this. I want to eat everything at once. This is delicious. I could eat it forever. Wow, and the box is edible too. What? Are you serious? Ugh, you gotta be kidding me. This isn't edible. Ugh, I'm left without fries. Or Coca Cola. Don't be upset. Here you go. Wow, thanks so much. It's really delicious. So the heroes have a responsible task to feed the baby. And what does she want? The baby wants french fries. Mm -hmm. Nothing complicated. We'll do everything. I know the recipe. It seems that you need to pour oil. I'll pour more. It'll be fatter and tastier. So for sure, everything will fry well. I'll fill up the whole pan with some oil. Let's turn it on and let's start. I'll use the whole pack because there are never too many of the french fries. Hey. Granddaughter, what are you doing? Oh, it's burning! We need to put out the fire quickly! Oh no, 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 no! It's not like the recipe on YouTube! 
almost burned down the kitchen and all of us. Oh. Better learn from grandma. Now grandma will show you how to do it. We'll take quite a bit of oil. Turn down the heat a little and put the potatoes in. So it'll be perfect. I'll toss it around and put it on a plate. What? Oh, how well it turned out. It's all for my granddaughter. It remains to add the most delicious ketchup. French fries and ketchup are the perfect combination. My granddaughter will definitely like it. And how many calories are in this dish? I'll show you how it should be. We get rid of excess oil. Then we wrap the potatoes in a piece of fragrant bacon and twist the roll. Just like that. Add a drop of cranberry gluten-free jam from Duro's on top. Just like that. And add some rosemary on top. The masterpiece is ready. Bingo! I've come up with something better. Banana marshmallow trolley is so similar to potatoes. And if you add Hershey's strawberry mm -hmm. syrup, it will be just like potatoes with ketchup. But it tastes so sweet. That's what my little sister will really like. Finally, everything is ready. And the baby has already been waiting for her food. The dish from my grandmother was the first to attract attention. Classic french fries and ketchup. It looks really delicious. The baby obviously liked it. I wonder how she would like a dish for real gourmets. The chef took an unusual recipe, but it was not appreciated. And there was a gift from my sister. It looks like potatoes and ketchup, but this… Yes! It's a sweet marshmallow with strawberry sauce. Deep and eat. Hmm. It remains to choose the winner. A dish from grandma. Yes, I won. Oh, it hurts. What will the baby want to eat now? Oh, she wants to eat sushi. What is this? I don't know how to cook it. Show grandma what to do. First, you need to boil the rice in a special way. I'll do it. Grandma knows how to cook rice. Ah, <laughs> uh, sushi with nasty seaweed. I'd rather do something sweet again. Or sweet and sour. Let's take the sweet and sour tongues. Add whipped cream instead of sauce. Rub a marmalade eye and a few marmalades from Haribo. How big and colorful they turn out. Have you ever seen sushi like that? This is just absolutely <laughs> perfect. Now you need to take a sheet of nori and cut it in half. It's all dry, it's breaking. How did you do that? Because I'm a professional, Grandma. I'm gonna cut some fish. Perfect slices. Put some rice on the mat. And some nori. I twist it with the mat. Put some fish on top. Cut it. And that's it. Classic Philadelphia roll with ginger and wasabi is ready. <laughs> Granny can't make these rolls of yours. They don't keep their shape. Bingo! I have an idea. I'm just gonna cut some cucumbers. Get rid of the center and put rice in it. Perfect. <laughs> now it's time for the baby to try it. Let's start with these. Sushi from the chef looked perfect. And it tastes incredible. What a big and bright roll. And very, very tasty. So delicious that she immediately chose them as the winner. This time, a sweet gift from my sister overcame everyone. Oh, you haven't tried mine. Hey, Grandma, wake up. The granddaughter wants something delicious again. She wants to drink a chocolate cocktail for dessert. This is my favorite recipe. We'll need some ice cubes. I'll pour more chocolate sauce into the jar. Starbucks milk chocolate to the brim. And I'll create some milk foam with a hand mixer. Oh, um, sorry, Grandma. You got too close. What is this bag in Grandma's hands? Instant coffee three in one? 
Is she really going to give this to her granddaughter? Yeah, but it seems that grandma herself likes it. Now add the whipped cream. I often cook myself such a recipe. By the way, don't forget about yourself! Sprinkle the Oreo cookie crumbs on top. Put the cookie on. Such a cocktail should be drunk through a straw. That's it! The perfect chocolate milkshake. Who cooks it like that? That's a horror! I have made coffee sweet drinks more than once. We need fresh coffee beans. I measure everything to the gram. I grind the grains into fine crumbs. Then I brew it in French press. The coffee will be perfect. Pour it into the cup. And adding some milk. I'm gonna create some foam out of it. I certainly won't spray anyone because I'm unprofessional. And the snowflake decoration. Perfect. <laughs> oh my! It's time to try the drinks. The hand itself reaches for a beautiful glass. It's a wonderful cocktail. Also delicious cookies on top. Awesome. It's perfect! Hmm. What cannot be said about the instant coffee? Grandma wanted to poison her granddaughter. It's impossible to drink. Oh. Coffee foam from the chef with a pleasant aroma. But the hmm. taste is nothing unusual. The baby chooses the beautiful cocktail. Yes, keep it up, sis. You've won again. The next task is for you to drum roll make some waffles. Okay. What? What is it? And I know the recipe. Break the eggs. Add sugar. You can have more so the waffles will taste even better. And get in the way, get in the way, get in the way! Oh, I'm tired of doing that. Perhaps that's enough. And now we can add some flour. How much is needed? Oh, uh, grandma, I'm sorry, I got you dirty again. More flour, more waffles. Oh, uh, maybe you don't need so much flour. I'll put the X's back. It won't work out that way. But you will definitely like my old grandmother's proven recipe. The dough came out perfect. <laughs> Here! Now you can pour the dough into the waffle iron. And I'm almost done too. Perfect rosy waffles will come soon. <laughs> what are you feeding the baby? No. It is necessary to eat healthy food. Oh. We won't need sugar. <laughs> we better take zucchini. Perfect. Now we're gonna add some eggs, put flour, and we're gonna create some dough. I'll do it quickly with a mixer. How ugly it looks! And let's try our super healthy waffles. <sighs> They're almost done! Yummy! Perfect! I'll put it on a plate. Add some strawberry whipped cream and berries. I love how it turned out. And I'm gonna put some traditional maple syrup. Pour it all over. Oh my god. And a piece of butter. <laughs> Lovely. Oh my. Oh, the waffles are done. Green is the color of health. There's not enough beauty in this presentation. I'll make the count's runes and more greenery on top. Bellissimo. <laughs> oh, she's what? back with her proper nutrition. <laughs> Here, granddaughter. These waffles look exactly like she wanted them to. But was it this unusual feeling? <gasps> An eggshell! You have to be careful when you cook. And what is this green color? Grass on top again? Still a piece is worth a try. A very small one. <laughs> it smells good. But that still tastes disgusting. What to expect from these waffles? Wow, it seems that the baby really liked them. Here's the winner. Hooray, they're mine! Jill, what are you doing? I want french fries. Okay. Well, that is easy. The guys can handle it. Cool. Mm -hmm. I definitely need oil. I have to cook the fries somehow. Oh, let's do this. 
Pouring some oil into the pan. And some fries! Oh! Oh! oh there's oil coming everywhere! Oh, granddaughter! This needs to be put out right now! Oh, sorry, Jill. I got a little foam on you. Sorry, honey. Let me clean it up. Oh, don't do that. I can do it all by myself. <gasps> My french fries! Oh, they're all foamy and burnt. But I have an idea. I always have Kit Kat in my pocket. If you break it into sticks, it's kind of like fries, you know, but chocolate fries. With a slight movement, we got some chocolate fries. Let's put them in the package. And onto the plate. Where can we go without sauce? But this time, we're gonna use chocolate syrup. It'll definitely work. How do you like it? No. This is terribly bad. I'm going to show you how to cook it. Yes. First, we get rid of the frozen fries because they're definitely not for us. We are gonna peel the potato and cut it. Oh yeah. With some slight movements. Well, I'm a professional. I always have original ideas, so we will use an all Chinese recipe. We put potatoes between Chinese chopsticks and slice it. But not all the way through. Put everything on a skewer. Perfect. Now we need to put it into the oven and wait for it to be ready. Oh, that's very cool. I decided to boil my potatoes. I think it will be more convenient to cook my favorite potatoes that way. We need to smash the potato. It's going to be mashed potatoes indeed. Done. Do not forget to salt it. And a little flour. Oh, there we go. And mix everything. Alrighty, we got potato dough. Oh, <laughs> tricked you. I'm gonna roll it out with a rolling pin. Awesome. And my favorite mug with my smiley face on it. Awesome. We got some circles going on. I'm gonna make smiley faces there. Now, let's put it into the oven to bake. My gorgeous potatoes are ready. Oh, looks amazing. Cool. We're gonna need some sauce, and I'm going to make homemade ketchup. I need one tomato, and yes. we put it into the blender. Let's turn it on and grind everything into tomato puree. Alrighty. Pouring everything into a container and a basil leaf. Perfect. Oh, how appetizing! And what do I have? Oh, this is so cute. Oh, but that's not for you. So, I'm going to use regular ketchup for the sauce. I'm not ashamed because I'm a big ketchup fan myself. Look at that. Let's go to Monica for tasting. Monica, get started. These look funny. Let's try them now. Mm. Wow, it's delicious. I want some more. Mm. Awesome. Grandma, you're amazing. What's in here? Yes. Are these McDonald's fries? <gasps> no, they're not! Let's try it with the sauce. Mmm, chocolate syrup and Kit Kat. Cool. cool, sis! What did the chef make? This is kind of weird. Okay. Hmm, boring. Hmm. Tomato puree? Mmm, not impressive. Well. I choose Grandma as the winner! Oh, me? Seriously? Oh, you <gasps> This is amazing! <laughs> what does baby girl want this time? Show us. Wow, it's a sandwich! That's cool! Okay. 
Let's make it. Guys, ready? Well, it's not even a meal. It's just a regular snack. Let's put some bread in the toaster and wait a little. Oh, some pita Oh! Oh! You scared me! Oh, goodness! Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you, girls. I'm back to cooking. I'm making a peanut butter sandwich with my signature strawberry jam. Little Monica absolutely loves it. Oh, smells delicious. Let's put some on the other half of the toast. And voila! Here's my lovely sandwich. Guys, I have everything ready to go. Wow, your sandwich looks so appetizing. Oh yeah, I'm sorry. Wanted to eat it myself. Okay, I'm going to make a sandwich for my favorite sis. This masterpiece should win for sure. I'm going to go with a classic ham and cheese sandwich. It's perfect. The higher, the better. Now we need some mayonnaise so it's not too dry. Oh yeah. Perfect! Let's dip everything in my favorite Cheeto chips. I just have to crush them first. Well, perfect crumb. Woohoo! We got it! But that's not all. I need to dip fry the sandwich in oil so the cheese stretches all the way to China. Oh yeah. Done. Now that's some seriously yummy goodness. I'm drooling. Oh, what are you guys staring at me like that for? I started making my own sandwich a long time ago. Well, I'm making my own bread. And I need dough for that. But first, we're gonna color it. Now that's what I'm talking about. We're gonna roll it out with the help of my professional rolling pin. And it's gonna be all in rainbow colors. Let's send it into the oven to bake. Good thing I have a super power oven that does everything in seconds. Perfect. Wow! Oh, what does smell so good? Chef, is that you? Of course. The perfect bread knife. Thank you, Grandma, for the compliment, by the way. You're okay too, bud. Definitely not in cooking. Okay, slicing the bread and adding some toppings. I definitely need some rainbow cheese. It was made especially for me. Grown in fields where unicorns graze. <laughs> all done. Wow, how different all the sandwiches are. And this one is so huge. Let's see. Wow, it's so delicious. What's inside? Oh, cheese and ham. What's next? Hmm. This looks delicious, bud. Let's give it a shot. Um, yeah, delicious. What's next? Wow! Rainbow cheese sandwich! But how does it taste like? Um, pretty good. Mmm. I have decided the winner is Sis and her huge sandwich! It's delicious! Oh yeah, I'm the best! I don't want to distract anyone, but Monica is drooling. Show us, baby, what do you want? Oh, it's fried eggs! Chef's a pro at this and grandma makes this every morning. Sis will definitely come up with something. Well, guys, why don't you start cooking? Okay. Anyone can make fried eggs. It's a piece of cake. But I hate to break my eggs. Oh, poor thing. We better clean it up a little, or Monica won't be able to enjoy it. Gross. Let's turn up the heat and watch it cook. Oh, what a good girl you are. Now grandma's going to show you a more interesting way of cooking eggs. I need yellow pepper. We're going to peel it and… Oh, there we go. Well, we're not peeling it, we're cutting it, of course. 
And we got some rings. <laughs> Pretty yummy. Then we pour some oil into the frying pan. And putting our little pepper rings on it. Oh, uh, Jill, what did you do to the eggs? Okay, cracking them into our pepper rings. Let's get cooking! Oh, it's beautiful! Oh, this dish reminds me of flowers. Putting everything on a plate and it's done! Oh, Grandma, I need to take a couple eggs and crack them into a bowl. Great, that's enough. Now I will need my new kitchen gadget to safely remove the yolk and only leave the whites in the bowl. Please. Oh, you want to play with it? Okay, here you go. Wow, that's some cool stuff! The fish looks so funny! Oh, it takes so little for a child to be happy. I need a good mixer to whip up the whites into foam. Perfect consistency. Cool. Now we we'll lay it all out in parchment. Yes. And sand it into the oven until cooked through. It's going to take a little bit of time. Jill, do you want me to show you something? It's a rabbit, but I won't give it to you. <laughs> I'm gonna need this rabbit to make bunny eggs. It's going to be amazing. But it's gonna be delicious as well. Let's pour the whites and let's not forget about the yolks. They'll be great for the ice. Now we have to get everything ready. Oh, I smell something burnt. Oh no! I forgot about my eggs! How am I supposed to feed this to Monica? Yes. But I have an idea! I could make yogurt eggs! Oh! Um, okay, never mind. I've seen this on TikTok. Let's get started. I need to carefully place the yogurt on a plate in the shape of an egg. Oh, oh, yeah, sorry, Grandma. Definitely need your help. Oh, it's kind of hard. Oh, how do we open it? Go, go, go! Oops. What is that? I want to try it. It's so easy to open. Um, uh, that's mine, sis, thank you. But I didn't even try it! Monica was able to open this. Oh, whatever. Anyway, I need to have a peach. That'll be the yolk. There we go. And I need greens. We'll put a lawn on the plate. And I'll have a bunny on it. It's done. Oh, this cute cloud will look so perfect! It's like a sunshine! Oh, wow! I've been waiting for so long! Let's start with a fork and a knife. I'm gonna try granny's eggs first. Let's see. Well, that's weird, but <laughs> delicious. Thank you, granny. What's in here? Doesn't even look like an egg. Let's try it. Wow! I've never tasted anything like this! And what do we have here? It's yogurt! <laughs> nice, but we're moving on. Hmm, what is this? <gasps> cool! Oh, that is nice! And that's a cloud! Wait, this is amazing! Well, chef wins for sure! Oh, finally. That's my talent. Yes. Yummy! Emily likes to everyone! Hey! Guys, stop eating food! You've got food to cook with! Let's find out what baby Margot wants! She wants ice cream! I think everyone is ready. Then, let's get started! I want to make delicious strawberry ice cream! Oh, uh, Emma, do you want some? Oh, here you go. Oh, uh, I got this fresh strawberries. I picked them in the morning. Well, let's put all of it in the pan. Add a little sugar. And then we will boil it up. 
Well, there we go. Oh, Emma, where are your fingers going? Oh, look at that. I'm a strawberry jam master. Putting everything in a bowl. And we will add some milk. What ice cream is made without milk? <laughs> Only bad ice cream. And mixing it up. Oh, all that's left is to pour it into a bowl and cool it down. Oh, awesome. Let's put everything in the fridge. And wait. Nice. I'm done. Um, what's that stuff? Oh, something green, I don't need it. Oh, what's that? Who's throwing food around? Grandma, yours? Oh, not mine. My granddaughter must have dropped it. Oh, I don't need that. Oh, not that. Hmm? This is a completely different matter. I love Nutella. Mm, it's so good. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Right. I'll make fried ice cream. Do you know what it is? I'll show you the recipe. We need a special pan for fried ice cream. We'll add some mini Oreos and powdered sugar. Let's chop everything into crumbs with a sharp spatula. Pour milk into the crumbs and mix thoroughly. When the mixture hardens, we twist rolls like this. Awesome, that's great! Let's put it on a nice plate and decorate with strawberries. But that's not all. Let's add a shock effect. Dry ice. Cover everything with a tray so the smoke doesn't go anywhere. It's a mystery effect. Wow. Oh, it's really nice. My ice cream. Well, it's frozen. Oh, now it's time to move on to beautiful serving. I don't think I can do like Chef, but I'm just a regular grandma. Oh, how do you like it, Emma? Oh, this is very appetizing. Oh, my oh what about mine? Nutella has hit my head and completely knocked out my ice cream thoughts. We have to make it now. Adding some milk and… Um, let's freeze it now. Closing the lid, shaking it, and… Oh, come on, come on! Oh, Margo, you already want ice cream? Uh, okay. Now that everyone is ready, let's hurry up. Hmm. Wow! Such great ice cream! Oh, there's a whole magical thing here! Oh, let's try it. Mmm. <laughs> it's with Oreos. It's delicious. <laughs> What's next? Nutella ice cream? Huh? Ugh. It's just milk and Nutella? No. Ugh, not gonna try that. But this looks really good. Let's put it in. <laughs> mm. oh, what's with the leaves here? Gross. Oh, delicious strawberries. Well, our winner is the chef. Oh, Margot. Yay, let me kiss you. I win! Guys, Margot is about to tell us about her new dish. What is that? Wow, pancakes! <laughs> Great choice. If you love pancakes, give it a thumbs up. Well, everyone is ready. Let's get started. I'm going to make mini pancakes. In a form of cereal. Oh, they're so nice! Grandma, don't touch that. Since Chef makes pancakes like that, I'm gonna have some. <laughs> right. I have a picture with my best friend Archie. I'll make a pancake art with his portrait. I need to draw an outline of my favorite pack with black dough. Next, we will fill in with white and black. Like his fur. I have a Dalmatian, so that's why this coloring is funny. Now adding some colorful details and flipping it over. Yay, it worked! Oh, Emma, you're so good. I'll give you a kiss. Uh, it wasn't necessary. Ready-made dough is interesting, no. but I want to make something healthier. Hey. Oh, Grandma can oh, make her own dough. <laughs> Wait a second, now you'll see. We're grating the zucchini and carrots. Then we put flour in a bowl, beat one egg, and pouring in some milk. There we go. 
Mixing it all up. These are the natural colors. All that's left is to cook everything on a pen. Well, ready. Oh, Emma, do you want some? Oh, what a horror. I think Margot will love grandma's healthy pancakes. We add some yogurt and some fragrant herbs. Done. Chef, what do you think? Uh, don't need to bring it that close. I'm about to show you some real awesome pancakes. Putting my mini pancakes into a cup. Hmm. It's hmm. perfect. <gasps> totally fits the shape. Now we need to pour in some raspberry jam. What kind of pancakes are eaten without jam? And oh, yeah. the last step. We will add some milk into our pancakes. Mm, I'm brilliant. As always. Well, let's serve it. Bon appetit, Margot. What? Mm, those pancakes look weird. Ugh, doesn't smell good, but what does it taste like? Oh, it sucks! And what do we have here? Wow! Mm. Pancakes in the form of cereal! Good. Cool! Let's try them separately. Nice. Mm, delicious! I love it. <gasps> What's in here? What a cute doggy! Let's try it. Oh, this is so good! I want to eat it all! Amazing! I'll give the win to sis! Oh, I'm amazing! Emma, stop it! I can't draw with all this noise! Oh. And I want a cocktail! Oh, no worries. Oh, uh, what? Huh, easy. Well, first… <laughs> yeah, we need ice cream. I will make the best cocktail ever! Scooping the ice cream and putting it in the blender. <laughs> Adding some milk. And… Love is definitely not superfluous! Let's turn it on and wait. Oh no! Oh, Emma! You have to put the lid on! Turn the blender off! Oh my gosh! I'm sorry, Grandma. The smoothie is ready, bud. I need to add some sweet syrup. Bubblegum flavored syrup is just the right one. And some whipped cream on top! Mmm, sweet candy nerds are awesome! Let's pour it all over the shake and put this try in. This looks so good. What do you think? Does it look like the one Margot drew? Oh, that's amazing. But I should start cooking too. I'll get chocolate ice cream. Let's throw it into a bowl and pour milk over it. Oh, a banana is amazing. Oh, I should add it there too. Great. Let's stir it up. And pouring it into the best mug ever. We'll pull the chef around. Duh. Oh, who turned off the lights? Oh, Granny, did you do it? Oh, she's asleep. Okay, let's start making the cocktail. I need an ice cream scoop. Setting it into a glass and pouring in some fresh milk. Let's stir it up well. And hmm, our pineapple is going to be the container. Pour everything in there. Hmm, now we're gonna greet a bounty bar. Coconut notes will not be super blueless. Decorating it with umbrellas, chocolates, and inserting the straw. Masterpiece cocktail is ready. Well, Margot, time to try. <laughs> wow, what a great smoothie and a pineapple! Oh, it's awesome! It's really delicious. <laughs> oh, what is this? Mmm, Grandma, yummy. it's delicious as usual. And here's something interesting. Wow, it's so sweet. <gasps> and drum roll, Chef's cocktail wins. Oh, man. Oh, it's mine again. I'm great. What are all these ingredients for? I want nuggets. Can you do that? Okay, no problem. 
Okay, anything for my granddaughter? Let's get started soon. There's so much work. We take chicken filet, carefully cut it in half, and now using my cookie cutter molds. These are so cool. They're gonna be dinosaurs? Oh, yes. Now let's start. We cut the chicken fillets into dinosaur shapes. Wow. Well, oh, Emma, thank you. Oh, my. Oh, oh chef? Everybody stand and watch me. I'm going to show you real nuggets. You have to cut the fish into small pieces. Adding some salt and pepper. There we go. Perfect. Now, some breading. Pouring oil into a pan, and let's send everything into the fryer. Oh, it's going to be so crispy. Oh, can't you be careful? The oil's shooting out! Oh, now I'll cook my nuggets. I have breading right here. We pour the breading on a plate and throwing our dinosaur nuggets in it. Now put a parchment sheet on a baking tray and lay out the dino nuggets. Send them to bake in the oven. And don't forget to end the clock so we don't forget about them. Perfect. Now we'll take a nap. Uh, grandma, I'm not comfortable working. Mm, chicken looks gross. I'll make my own signature nuggets. Hmm. No one has done that for sure. I have some wonderful Mars cookies. I'm gonna crumble them into crumbs now. Uh, but they're just for Margot. There we go. Mm, peanut butter taste! We're pouring it into the crumble and stirring it. Peanut hmm. butter paste is just amazing, but it looks kind of weird. But what if we add cacao and use it as a breading? <laughs> Let's do this. Now that looks more appetizing. And some chocolate syrup. Grandma, wake up! Look! Mm -hmm. Oh, they remind me of Coles. Uh, but granddaughter, you tried so hard. Ugh, that's disgusting. Mine are so much better. We're putting it on a plate. And my gold decorations. What are you guys doing? Oh, I forgot to warn you. Okay. Grating some gold on the nuggets. It's going to be just incredible. And some cranberry sauce. It goes great with fish. Spread it on the plate and we're done. Oh, it looks pretty expensive. Oh, oh, that's my alarm clock. Oh, the don't panic. Granny has solved the problem. Let's open the oven and get out my nuggets. Oh, it smells so good. Emma, can't talk to you right now. I need lettuce leaves for serving. Putting broccoli on top. And putting my dino nuggets. Oh, it turned out great! Mm. Wow, everything smells so good! This dish looks very gourmet. Need to try it soon. <laughs> oh, is that fish? It's disgusting! What? Let's try these. Mm, smells like chocolate. Let's see if it's good. Dipping in chocolate syrup and… Mmm. It's so delicious! Yes. It was this lovely thing. A dinosaur lawn? That's so cute. Well, nice to meet you, Mr. Dinosaurs. And now I'm gonna eat mm, you. Yummy. This is awesome! And… Grandma wins! Oh, I've waited so long to win. I'm really good at cooking. Whoa, you want a pink donut? It's quite easy to cook it. Our guys will do it in seconds, I promise. Ryan, you need to cook a donut, not eat Nutella. Okay, get started soon before baby Kate starts crying again. So, what does Kate need to do there? Oh, a donut. So it's easier than ever. I'm going to make her my signature Oreo donuts. All I need to do is to grind the cookies into dust. A jackhammer will help me with this. Now we'll break everything into crumbs. Uh, this thing is so hard to control. 
I think it's almost done. A little more. Oh, okay. Huh? Who's that? Uncle Bilger? Is this yours? Hey. Oh, beauties, hello. Yeah. Now pour everything into a bowl and pour the Nutella into it. And now I'm going to need another cool tool. A finger. Mix everything up. Great. It's so delicious. Oh, Grandma, do you want to try it? Uh, okay. Mm. I haven't licked it yet. Well, you need to pour everything into the donut oven. I think it'll be incredibly delicious. Well, I just got a little no. dirty big deal. Huh? Come on, wipe it all off. In the meantime, I'll get on with my donuts. My stuff is already warmed up. So we spread the dough. Ah, oh, chef, what do you have? And I have gorgeous, delicious donuts. Just look at it, how delicious and lush they are. But that's not all. I need to decorate them with marshmallows and gold on top. It will turn out incredibly tasty. That's how it already looks even more appetizing. But that's not all. I have to cover my sandwich with chocolate-covered donuts and sprinkle it with more gold. Do you like it? What do you have? Ah, I have got donuts ready too. Now I'm going to show off my handsome ones. You don't need to add anything. You just add powdered sugar, that's it. Ah, Brian, your donuts are burning. Oh, what? Oh, that's right, my donuts are very fried. And they're so black because they're burned or because they're made of Oreo. Come on, now add some melted marshmallow and go. Pour some strawberry syrup and the final touch, Maltesers. Oh, they're my favorite. The baby's crazy about it. That's it, Kate, donuts are waiting for you. How? Which one should I choose? Oh, that's right. I want these. Ew. Trying? Ew. What? No. What is this in my mouth? That's gold. I don't like that. What else is there? Oh, cute donuts. I really like them. Oh, and what's there? Wow. These donuts look so appetizing. Also, my favorite sweets. It's definitely delicious. Awesome. Hmm, let's see what does it taste like. So good and chocolatey. Mm. I'll give the victory to my brother. <laughs> yeah, I did it. I made the most delicious donuts. Uh -huh. And make me some waffles. Mm. Hmm, my granddaughter wants delicious yeah. waffles. It's easier than ever. Let's start with the dough. <laughs> I need to add some flour and eggs. Now I'm gonna add a piece of butter and put it in the bowl. Oh, one piece flew somewhere. Oh, thank you, chef. And now a little sugar and milk. Oh, so fresh. It's delicious. Now we mix everything up. Granny, come on. You're putting your dough all over the place. Ah, oh, fine, sorry. Now I need some Skittles. I'm going to have amazing Skittles candy waffles. It will turn out very tasty. Nice. What should I do? I don't even know how to cook waffles at all. Ooh, I've got a cool idea. I had noodles in my briefcase somewhere. Hmm, I don't eat this. Oh, I lost it a week ago. Oh, here are my delicious noodles. Now I'm going to try and waffle out of it. Ooh, you just need to put it in the waffle iron and you're done. Look, I'll add some ketchup and make a muzzle. Cool, right? Huh. And I have a waffle ready. It pulls out and adds a stack. Cool. Add a little maple syrup. Wow, it looks delicious. Oh and I need strawberry syrup. Pour some into a glass in the shape of a heart. And here's my waffle made from Skittles. Look, we insert it and it's done. Kate, mm. you can try. Wow, there are so many delicious things here, and it looks awesome. We need to try it soon. Whoa, how delicious. Oh, what's there? Oh, my favorite strawberry syrup. Cool. Hmm, what delicious is here? Whoa, these waffles are definitely made by my grandmother. Oh, it's not the first time I'm going to eat them. Very tasty. Oh, I eat too many waffles. But I still have my brother's waffle left. We should try it. Wow. Mm, it's not sweet, it's noodles. Cool, and with ketchup, it's delicious. 
Ah, oh, but I'm too full. I feel kind of bad. But the chef wins. Yeah, her. Oh, wow. I knew I was going to win. My waffles are the most delicious. Now I want a liquid Coke candy. I'm waiting for okay. you cool dishes. <laughs> it's a piece of cake. Now let's cook something awesome. I need an empty bottle of Coca-Cola. Oh, it's not that hard. Oops, I'm sorry. Now you need to pour corn syrup into the bottle. Just like that. We need so much of it. Great. Now let's add some candies. <laughs> cool, right, Grandma? Look. Uh, oh, no. My hand is stuck. Ouch. <laughs> oh, something went wrong. It's all right. I just hit a little bit. But I was able to mix the candy. And now we just need to freeze it. We're not afraid. We're afraid to solid state, so the candy is incredibly delicious. Grandma, what do you think? Do you like it? Oh, your candies are harmful. It is better to make not from cola, but from honey. It'll be much more useful. Ah, oh, chef, what are you doing there? I've already come up with a brilliant idea. This recipe will definitely appeal to the baby. You just need to pour Coca-Cola into a frying pan, add more marmalades with Coca-Cola, and mix it. Oh, and my candy is already ready. Oh, how cold it is. Ah, yes. it's very cold. And I just need a bowl of ice. You need to pour some liquid mm -hmm. nitrogen here. Hmm. This will definitely enhance the effects of the ice, and I will be able to freeze my candy much faster. Great. Now pour the contents of the pan into a bottle, and you can put it into a bowl with ice. Just look at what chemistry is doing. Perfect. The bottle froze instantly. <gasps> Grandma, don't touch it. Do you want to turn your hand into ice? Now you can serve. Wow, everything looks even better than I imagined. I'm going to try this candy. Oh, in a teddy bear bottle. Cool. Let's taste it. Whoa, it's honey. Well, it's usual. What's here? Oh, how cold it is. It's cold, it's cold, it's cold. Oh, we need to come up with something. Oh, that's better. How do I get the candy out? Come on, get out. Oh, it worked. Hmm, it's delicious. What did my brother do? Oh, it looks cool. Huh, how cool it is. Let's try. Mmm, I like mm. this candy. Yes. Brother wins. Hooray, I knew I was the best. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, I decided that now I want scrambled eggs. Just make something really tasty. Mm. Chef, you don't only have to do it. Okay. It's a piece of cake with grandma. But Brian will come up with something. Let's get started. Whatever. No, no, I need to pour some oil. Huh? Hey, pour it out. Come on. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Oh, grandma. It hurts. So, now we break a couple of eggs. Oh, I'm sorry, grandma. I just got carried away cooking. Whoa, it's not bad. We urgently oh need God. to cook something edible. Otherwise, after Brian scrambled eggs, we can go to the hospital. Look. Here, look how you need to do it. Brian, how can you do that? Everything burned down. Let's fix it now. I'm going to have scrambled eggs made of liquid marshmallows uh -huh. and a peach. Does it look like yours? It seems that yes. Huh, what do I do? Oh, great. It is necessary to add some fresh vegetables and herbs. Hmm. Your scrambled eggs look too primitive. Now I'll show you how to cook restaurant scrambled eggs. I won't be a classic shape, but in the shape of... Hey, where is my uniform? <laughs> Ryan. This is my dragon. Great. Crowd the black mess and fry. Now we make ice and fire. Perfect. This dragon turned out to be so cute and Kate will definitely appreciate it. I also embody on a play the place where my dragon grazes. Don't say anything. I know I did it perfectly. Let's find out what Kate thinks. Wow! There are so many things! I want to try this dragon here. Whoa, it's a cool one and delicious. What do you have here? Okay. Huh? Whoa, tomatoes. I love that. Yeah. Yummy. Mm-hmm. And what about the scrambled eggs? Well, it's kind of simple. Okay. Mm, fine. What's here? Wow. Uh, Is it a peach? What's mm -hmm. the deal with this thing? Mmm, yogurt, cool. I really like sweet scrambled eggs. I give the victory to my brother. So good. Awesome.
Mm, I just want to mm. lick the plate. Congratulations, bro. Oh, I won again. That's my luck. Well, I'm almost ready. Oh, there we go. Let's start with a smoothie. I love it so much. I can do that. <laughs> you got it. Oh, no problem. Hey. Okay, I'm going to start with the greens. It's spinach. Oh. Oh, please. Next up is the blender. Yeah, you're gonna help me out here. Okay, putting it inside. Oh, how do I do that? It's easy. Oh, thanks, Jill. Could you please? Oh, that's not all of it. Okay, a blend, blend, blend. Done. Oh, well, the first part is done. Of course, that's not all of it, too. We'll need something else to make the smoothie tasty. Nice. Like, um, yogurt, for example. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, uh, candy. Jill, that's for you. Oh, how do you open it? Oh, no! It's scattered everywhere! Oh, how careless. Well, the yogurt will go into the glass. Next is a watermelon. Everyone loves it. I'm only going to need one slice. Jill, this, uh, <laughs> this is for you. What? A slice of watermelon needs to be cut into pieces. Oh, Jill! You, uh, oh, you must have enjoyed the watermelon too much. Oh, well, I hope Vicky will enjoy it too. Done. Now we have some watermelon juice. Some straws. And I'm done. No. Well, I don't need all that fruit. Oh, man. <laughs> Ugh, and that too. No, oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I wasn't aiming at you. Just wanted to get rid of that. Oh yeah, we're gonna use some sodas. Everyone sure does love them. Yes. These sodas need to be poured into a special cup. Well, into different ones, according by color. And then we're gonna turn it into Slurpees! And different layers of it! Some decor, an umbrella, and a straw. Amazing! What? Okay, now the professional is going to do her job. We're gonna need some strawberries, blending them all up. We also had some cream there, of course. <laughs> and now, that will be the base for our fountain. Just look at that. It's both delicious and spectacular. Oh, I'm gonna start with this smoothie. Cool. Gummies are delicious. The smoothie itself is pretty good, too. I love it. Hmm, what do we have next? Grandma smoothie? Hmm, watermelon. I love it. Well, let's try the smoothie itself. Ugh, this sucks. Not sweet at all. Oh, well, what is that? It looks amazing. This is definitely the winner. Oh, yeah, I'm a professional. For round two, I want some. Waffles! I'm hungry for a snack. Grandma, don't get distracted. Oh, waffles? I can do that. Flour should be poured into a deep bowl and mixed with eggs and milk. Of course, you cannot forget about the sugar. All this mixture should be turned into dough. Great. Next, I pour it into a waffle iron. I've got it. Time to cook. Oh, oh it's so complicated. Mm. Even stirring it is hard. 
Oh yeah, I need a functional blender. Let's mix everything with it. And so Nutella! <laughs> well, the mixture is ready. Now let's pour it into the waffle iron. Only mine is a little bigger. Hey! Hey, what? Oh, who cares about the size of the waffle? It's the flavor that counts. My waffles are almost ready to go. Just need some maple syrup on top. Spectacular! Chef? I'm going to do something a little bit more complicated. I need some celery, eggs, and put it all into the blender. Next, I'm going to need flour. It's important not to overdo it. <clears throat> not too much. And let's blend everything up. And only now I can start making my waffles. Pouring the whole mixture inside and let's wait. Yeah, not for long. Ta-da! All ready to go. Let's put some delicious strawberries on top. Hmm, amazing. It's a real work of art. I think my waffles are ready, too. <laughs> wow, well, I want to make a street food-style waffle. Uh -oh, wait, Grandma, hold this. There we go. A scoop of ice cream. <laughs> Actually, a few of them. Some whipped cream. Oh, yeah. The more, the better. And some sprinkles on top. That's not all. A couple lollipops would be great, too. I'll finish it off with some strawberry syrup. Well, it's time for you to try it. How interesting! Everything is so beautiful! Look at these lips! They're funny! Mmm, amazing! But the waffle is the most important part! And it's great! And very unusual! Now let's try grandma's waffles. Cool. Also very tasty. Hmm, Chef Amy, look! Oh, a little fishy. Let's try it. Mmm, it's really delicious. What about the rest? Ew, what is that? No, the winner is… Jill! Oh, yes! Thank you! I got it! Now I want a burger! Can you surprise me? Easy. Of course. Burger? I've never made them before. Well, everything has to be done for the first time. Let's try it. First, we need to fry the patty. It's an essential part of any burger. Next, the bun. And some, um, toppings, I guess. Oh, uh, don't touch that. I think I'm going to make a cutlet myself. Hmm, first we're gonna grind meat. And fry it up. Amen. The patty is ready. Now it's time to pull out the gem of my collection. A golden bun. Oh, just look at that. <laughs> It's hard to even look at it. Oh, Grandma, I don't need that. It's too cheap. I'm gonna use some moldy cheese. Yahoo! Oh, yeah. That's what real luxury is all about. Perfect. Okay. Now me. I need to start by pouring some oil. Uh -oh, wait, what? Uh, the more, the better. Oh, you've got too much oil! It's going to splash! No big deal. A yellow jumpsuit instead of a gas mask. And I'll be safe. Oh yeah, that's amazing! Hey, you're not the only one here! 
Well, what am I supposed to do now? I guess I'm gonna have to make a sweet burger. I'm going to need a whole bunch of different goodies for it. First, some like with marshmallow. Then, adding some dye to it. This is going to be so much better. I will dip a bun into this mixture. And some sweets. The more, the better. Vicky, are you ready to choose? Come on! Oh, let's go. I'm always ready. Let's start with the expensive burger from Chef. I wonder what it tastes like. Hmm. I don't need a golden bun. Tomatoes are good. Nice. Wait. Why does the burger smell so bad? What? Is that the cheese? Ugh, disgusting! <laughs> oh, mamma mia! The sweet burger is awesome! But I'm kinda tired of sweets, to be honest. I want to eat something more serious, and that's grandma's burger. Now that's a different story, that's the winner! <laughs> <laughs>